Sasa tuendelee basi. Leo basi ni story ya DV Lottery tena. Tuange hiyo mpaka mwezi ishe. Sikia kuna story ina ndonge nyingine besides that. So wala wasome apply, wame apply ni poa sana. Kumbuka lakini kuna the most important thing ni mwana specifically kuna hiyo story ya photo ndio the most important. I repeat kama last time. Na ile kwa insist yani hiyo photo ndio muhimu. Ukiget hiyo photo right the rest ni kama very it's information you already have. Hata kama wataka kuna nime get download flani ya nime kama word document nilise kama word document if you need hiyo document utaniandikia comment kwa hii live stream na kutumia. Takwa poa hivyo. Au niandikie message to me link. Ya yeah, all the questions uiangalie before hata uanze kufeel. Ni juni muhimu kidu hivyo ju inakuwa easier ku ku figure out exactly what you need. Insta. Tani try ku monitor so TikTok hapa hivi. Ni je kama niko poa. So your photo is the most important by the way. Usi miss your point. Very very important your photo. Get your photo right to kupoa. Hautakuwa na shida yote after that. Everything it work out. Mwana sahi for ina ka. Nikawaje? Akia nani madhani kwa sub and prepared. Nikana mtoi leo akwa na track niambia anatafuta sahi leo ameshindwa umtu yaenda wapi tena. Track share. Sa. So dey over basi. So na nagatoa kwa both sides. Tuanze kama swali ya haraka before tuendelee. Kuna some sali za swali moja nda go through question in a few minutes. Kuna nani alikuwa kwanza? Alikuwa na Elite World Update. Alianza na niaje labda mnacho niaje. Ameka J, so I mean G instead of J. Kuna Mukaya Josh wasema na kungoja. Chelo kidogo lakini leave bana. Hopefully. Leo kuko warm kidogo kama ndio nimevaa at least short sleeve. Leo kuko slightly warmer than last week. Liko cold kidogo. Tuko fall hadi summer anymore. Season ni change. Hata ma leaves mmoja zote kabisa leaves. So vini ndio kamengia kwanza alafu kuna elite world alisema nina sema welcome uko loud and clear. Hiyo ni poa mmeconfirm audio. Moga ni statistics vitu sizigusi aski. Au oh, audio kofiti sasa. Na get confirmation ya audio kopo kila mahali. Audio kopo Uh, TikTok iko fiti. Uh, vini pia iko hapo pia TikTok na muona. So the most important uh how you doing? Okay, vini na kuona bado hapa. Sama kwa locked in. Na go through questions na karaka YouTube. Na try to figure out ku incorporate pia TikTok iko hapo kabisa kwa comp. Sinaga time poa. Lakini tuna whether ni leko baridi sasa itakuwa poa in the future. So VPL bo hope kupoa happy mashuja oh leo mashuja de alafu kafikiria sawa kitu kabisa weekend mu lala tu by the way mu lala tu besides ni lala leo paka kama 3 hours ago ni ajalbo kuna kama au ja clear debt ya help inaweza hinda usifike maju na green card ah uh, yata who cares about that uh, they know who cares nobody cares by the way Alessa kusu kitu kama hiyo. Mimi nasema ile kama maybe niko ignorant in a way sisi lakini naona kama there's nothing that can stop you kupata green card. Green card ni wewe ukipata green card upata green card. Hiyo hakuna kina ku stop kabisa. Tena ya just your phone. Yenda a little bit higher. Ni hard ku monitor jinsi ya kamera ya nyume kwa more clear. You wouldn't understand. I make it too bright. Sasa so swali ni hivi naongea juu ya photo tena. Nime get document fulani kwa na prepare jana about your specification ya photos. Alafu kuna pia ukienda kwa kama una apply kwa phone. Kuna inaitwa your software ni download leo inaitwa DV Lottery Photo Check or ni kama app una download kwa simu yako. You can use your phone kupiga picha. Lakini make sure ni ile kamera za kama phone ndio hii. Usitumie kamera ya mbele ya, ya ile na kufest tumia one of the back cameras hizo za nyuma ziko more clear than ziko na more megapixels kuliko hii ya mbele so kuna ni moja nilipata hapa hivi software naweza share kweli inaitwa passport photo rasizi naweza isemaje sasa itakuwa inakaje 
ah, sijui ni za describeaje ika it makes sense inakaa hivyo kama ni kwa kwa face inakaa hivyo ina hiyo picha kama iko na green na try to make video alafu nimesho exactly the way it looks like unasoma una, una hivi kwa malikicho inafaa kuwa kila kitu alafu unajiseti kabisa unasoma cha karibu close alafu unapiga picha ni try hivyo sasa ina, inasaidia kupiga hiyo picha ya passport size ni app inaitwa ni mimi download tu leo labda ndio make ya video kidogo upload a picture alafu una try to make sure kupoa kabisa that's what it is so we'll back to tiktok so kuna so many resources mwisho mna make video kids day kuna time poa kila saa niko busy repeat the app name nitoa app nitoa je nitoa passport photo passport photo app iko kwa android na kwa apple store ni kwa hivyo ya apple Uh, Android uh, Google Play na una download app alafu unapiga picha na simu kwa sababu unajua basically ukia apply application before tu fungue page ya application acha nifungue hiyo page kama naweza share hapa hivi haraka haraka YouTube YouTube naweza share TikTok siri share so kuja kwa nini na figure out history ya TikTok bana ni for time po I figure out unafaa kuona hiyo picha iko ready before ingie kwa hiyo story za kuingisha hizo nini presentation niende kwa slide ama video screen share screen tafuta screen ni a dv lottery hapa hivi share it expire yangu naweza refresh haraka haraka continue ndio hiyo screen na kaivo. Hii yangu ni ya last time. Acha nina kama ndairudisha back to ilikuwa wapi? DV lottery kwa wapi ndio hii hapa hivi. So ndio hapa hivi ni click ni refresh tena. Kama ni zaka from the beginning. So ina kaivo kuna ile main page inasema andika nini. Una zile authentication hapa this is not where I want to. But unaona vile naka ukishama za hiyo authentication hii kuna ingia kwa the next thing. Ikawa pick, acha ni ndio kama state.gov, tuna tu acha ni delete. Kwa application na kuja kwa state.gov ile straight up hivi. Alafu na click hapo hivyo. Itakaa hivyo sasa page, electronic diversity visa itakaa hivyo. So by the time na come kwa hii page, before kwa hii page kabisa kabisa kabisa, nafaa kuko na picha iko ready. Ndio mimi nasema to save time, fanya tu hivi if you want to save time. I don't waste time kwenda kupiga piga picha wewe mwenyewe. Let somebody do it for you. Unajua hivyo. Mtu mwerevu uta make sure uko na somebody is doing everything the right way. Kuna hizo if you need these specifications a picha, niambie enda kutumia. Niko na email nime create kama ka word document hivi. Nime track uzi ile nime copy kama page kadhaa kama five pages kwa word document. So ile kama tuseme unaweza iangalia ile pre before and the fill. Maybe u prepare hizo ma questions before. Sio kana za share hiyo document na zaangalia kana za share. Sina word hapa. Niko na word kweli hapa. Ana siji. Maybe niko naye. MacBook word. Ni try kama ta task kweli kweli. I think niko na word mali hapa. Cha niona kana za share kwa word. Apps kuja hapa. Updates. Nafanya update kwanza before it to me spin wow. So make sure kuna picha already kabisa. Kuna yani picha iko ready to go. Iko hizo specification. Alafu kumbuka kama kuna msali nitumia picha last week nikam show metadata. Ina show everything. Yani hii picha nilitumia last week siezi wa show kwa screen juu ni kitu private. Iko kwa hiyo si moja siezi show. Lakini ina show everything. Yani ina show which camera alitumia ilikuwa kamera gani ilikuwa Canon. Uh, ilikuwa uh, Canon ilikuwa imesema Canon 5D lens ilikuwa 1.8 f 1.8 yani everything hiyo camera paka date iko kwa hiyo information nili scroll nikiangalia alinitumia picha whatsapp imagine msali nitumia picha whatsapp ni verify kama iko poa alafu hiyo picha amenitumia ni kuangalia hivi metadata iko na everything yani basically if i want to replicate mpaka na ile camera alitumia lens alitumia ile f stop alitumia everything iko hiyo details by the way So usiseme utumia picha last year alafu useme kama uta, uta cheat system. Iko na waste time. Juwezi apply twice anyway. Muona sasa. In the meantime before ni fungue anything else. 
Pia kuna swali nilizo last week tani in large screen. Mtu yeye anatafuta kama nasikia sauti. Shinda huyu Buda ameenda wapi tuko hapa hivi sasa ina. Mu hang out na every candy sana. Ni nangi dio the week. Ananitafuta sasa hii. Musa ameenda wapi? Tuje kai tafunguka. Nimefunguka lakini lazima nikuwe na ni mind in times. Ananitafuta Sawa, so, hiyo entry twende tuko hiyo entry ile tuna share. So itakuwa hivi. The moment before ya kwa hiyo page ya kwanza kabisa ya ka kuna swali, zile kuna swali hapa. Repeat up. The first kwa na hiyo picha iko ready stand by. Kabisa, yani picha iko no questions, picha iko ready kabisa. 2 inches by 2 inches, hiyo ndio size ile kama una print out. Lakini digital so iko na 600 by 600. Hizo ni megapixel, 600 by 600. Lazima uise hivyo. That's the only modifications that do by the way. Watu wa photography wanajua kuifanya by the way. Kama mtu kama guru visuals anajua kuifanya kitu bila bila shida. Uko na photo, alafu unaingia kama hiyo photo iko phone yako, unaja change, umeichaki kwa nikapoa kabisa. Hata upate email u download kwa phone yako, unaweza apply. Nimeambia bro, anitumie picha yake, alafu kunitumia leo sijui kama msahau. Alafu nda apply, nda mu apply ya. Alafu nikimu apply ya jinata kwa apply mpaka to the end. Alafu ni tume ni go through your process yote. Leo tuko midway sasa hii. Leo ni 19th, 20th, 20th. Eh. Kama maybe less than maybe 15 days, nafungua the 5th. 15 days to go. Alafu wafunge hii story. Muone sasa. So kama after this tuko dongea story nyingine. Labda tutongea story ya how to fill up ni nini DS120 ama DS220. Kitakayo ile document next ile. The next step. Sina time poor lakini najaribu my best. Ile kila mtu ashikanishe. Lakini uki get photo right, hiyo ingine ni, ni obvious. But just in case, hauna hiyo information, nitumia email na kutumia document na kuna prepare. Iko hapa hivi na track ifungua. Ni vile bado ina update nini. Mutu ni ya Macbook, alafu Windows ni foreign kwa Macbook. Sijuka ime update, sana yukani ime update. Ya ime update, finally. Saa. Sana yukani ime update, zingine. Nifungue open. Updated two days ago ime open saa document niko na document yenyewe already hapa hivi so kitaka kujua si nitumie tu email by the way na share tu immediately whatever ukitatumia i will share it with you utakuwa naye kwa mimi afford na kila kitu kama uja apply already baka usha apply ni story nyingine so saa ina kai hivyo so page yenyewe ina kai hivi na feel kama naji repeat sasa hivi alafu tuende kwa maswali hata tu go back to maswali ya karaka ile watu wapi ndio wati yako oh keep enlightening hiyo ni uh, habib ali sasa so, kuna deno ni aje albo kama una una hauja clear there oh i don't think it's only story more by the way unajua you know, usi create atmosphere usi create sijui kwa nini watu wanaona hiyo story by the way nimeza ku digress kidogo usi when you're doing something ujai do maisha yako yote wacha kuwa na ile ni kama uko na fulfill prophecy Yaani unajua everything i do i always fail. Nikao unaji unaji yaani una, unajipatia ile reason why what a kama obstacle kwa life yako. Kuna wasemwa ambia eh hey, idiaje albo na ku buy truck. Kama kwa for example to, to be example ya trucking. Musa makama okay e kitoka na sasa makama in the next 5 minutes or so it will take maybe 14 years to figure out. Number one ni hivi. You don't know if you want to do trucking or not. Sawa, au juu uko sure kama unafanya tracking, au uko sure kabisa. Are you sure you're not sure? Okay, sasa, you're not sure. Okay. Usikie. Oh, I saw making 120 an hour. Really? Yeah. Okay. Nafikiri 120 an hour. Uh, how do I uh, the math is not mathing. Alafu na do how many hours a week? Inafaa kuwa 8 normally, but 8 ni ile spring. Sale unajua swanga na fenomeno moja hapa hivi uh, northern hemisphere. Winter iko na shorter days, longer nights. Alafu summer iko na longer days, shorter, shorter nights. So tukianza job April ama tume March na April na May to do kama 8 hours, maximum 9 hours. That's it. Lakini ikifika June, July, August, so do 12 hours, 13 hours, 14 hours. Juko na longer day. Yaani unapata by 5:30 asubuhi jua iko juu. The sun is up. Alafu ina settle 9 p.m. So kuna kuanzia 5 5 to 5 uni 12 hours alafu 6 7 8 9 so kuna 14 hours ya daylight by the way 
So kama ni job ya construction ukijua walianza 8 hours ama 7 hours in spring in summer inakuwa full blown. Wana try to push as many hours as possible ndio wa make up kile hours only lose. Winter ni hard to do job. Winter ni kama tu tuna move material. That's all you do. It's either to move snow from one spot to another ama to move material from one evo to evo. Winter inanga story mob. So una join 120. Okay kama there's a repetitive to specifically your 120 nile your business is getting paid so meaning you have income expenses period so it's up to you watu wengi fungua kama limited liability company ama unakuwa sole proprietor ile tu ni jina yako alafu inakuwa llc so proprietor do uh, separate na business yako llc ni poa in a in a sense as a small business do na separate business aspect na personal aspect so so llc to kwa right hand ni llc left hand ni wewe lakini because it's your business you're still the personal guarantor so lazima watumie your social security ku guarantee any loans kwa sababu when you're the human being behind your business sawa so, but in a separate the two so ukimeka 120 muse makama averagely job yetu expenses yoga between 30% ama 40% yoni expenses alafu unapata unabaki na hiyo 60% ama 70% depending on how much fuel cost mona fuel do determining factor so kama fuel ni cheap kama this ni cheap ni kama 30% so kwa na 120 tulishata back to 100 that means you, you 120 you make uki minus uh, approximately ni kama 90 naweza sema hivyo 90 kuna back 90 dollars an hour kutoa hiyo 30 kwa ni uh, 120 usime 35 35 hivi tuseme 80 iko fair enough hiyo 40000 ni kwa expenses hiyo ni mafuta ubaki na 80000 so you can decide how much do you want to pay yourself utajilipa 80 bucks an hour yeah you can do whatever you want it's up to you lakini kumbuka ukilipa 80 an hour suppose income yako inakuwa juu sana as an employee so kuna ile uko subjected to taxes so kile mu advice wase ni hivi tafuta reasonable wage ile tuseme kama uko na rent ya hao yako kama usema mu operate na budget ya 5000 lazima uko na budget by the way mu operate na budget ya 5000 sometimes more exceed depending kama say watu wake rudi chuo kuna zile ma school supply labda itakuwa 6000 7000 sijui but more operate na budget ya 5000 ile unchanged 5000 so ukisema 5000 so for the job kama 9 months na year to 10 months tuseme 9 months tuweke tuto hiyo 3 months ama ile winter alafu tuseme i'm paying myself 5000 a month kwa nini that's what my bills cost alafu times 12 ni 60k sa so, So it makes sense hivyo kabisa. So ukisema kama tuseme tupige hesabu hii tumaliza kila kitu hesabu. Tuseme kama uko na unanipoa lazima hiki unapiga hesabu before. Hii ni ile before upate CDL. You're deciding do I really want to do this or not. Usema hivi, ukilipa 120 alafu averagely the whole year. How many hours do you work? Wala wa Saudi job mediocre au do 1600 hours. But there's a daughter at 1000 hours kutaka but some averagely was it always sell the top cream de la cream while we available kila sa how do come at some between 1800 hours to 2000 hours a year sa so kila ta 120 times some 2000 is easy ume 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 run hard 2000 hours you need you you need 240000 sa almost a quarter million that's what your business makes na try to explain it to you what we alafu some Okay, tulisema expenses ni 30% ya hiyo expenses. Sawa. So, kama ni 100,000 itakuwa 60,000, alafu hiyo 40 to divide by 30% yake ni ngapi kwa 40? Naweza piga hiyo sababu haraka haraka. Itakuwa Okay, suppose tuseme toa ni toa Tuseme 200, toa hiyo 40, tuseme 40 ni truck payment out. Sawa. Ni less ama more, sijui. 40,000 ni namba kila 200,000. So 60,000 ni mafuta. Meaning kwa 200,000 to 60 utabaki na ngapi? 140. Sawa? So umetoa karibu 100,000 umetoa ni expenses peke yake. Truck payment, fuel na hizo expenses zingine. Umebaki na 160,000. Kwa unajili pa 5,000, how much will you pay yourself? Kama employee wa hiyo truck yako moja as a business. Itakuwa 60k. So business itabaki na 100,000. But in case you wanna I want to pay myself because I'm 60k ni poor junagalia tax bracket. Kuna vitu tuli do kama a month or two months ago, 
malikila tax bracket na four. So you tax bracket here for 40, 49, 59,000 to something, uko maybe the third level, your tax bracket. So uta jilipa 60, ukijua the lower side. Amu useme, usijilipe past ile, usto, us, us, yani don't get yourself out of your tax bracket. I think ilikuwa percentage ilikuwa ngapi, ilikuwa kuna 12%, kuna 24, utakuwa maybe 32. So that's your taxes, 32% of your income. So, angalia malu uta fit in. Kasabu wano una decide, you are the business, una decide. So, ukifit kwa yu tax bracket number three, kuna seven. Ufiki kwa yu number three, utajilipa kwa yu tax bracket number three as an employee. Then you'll pay your earned income tax, ya W2, from that. Mwana yu ni muhimu sana, because as much as kampuni ni yako, you want to show that you're making income as an individual too, ili personal income. Alafu lipe tax yu. Alafu na tax ya bizna. Everything lazimu lipe tax by the way. Don't even kill yourself. Lazimu lipe tax. Kusabu, uspalipo tax na stories ingine tena. But believe me, ukibaki na 100,000 kwa business, alafu ujilipe 60, alafu ulipe 100,000 business ni kama 15 tao. Alafu ujilipe ile 60, ujilipe tax ya 60 ya kwa ngapi, kama maybe whatever, maybe, I don't know, skumbuki 32%, ita kwa 20, something like that. But you know, ile pesa ile umejilipa 60, utajilipa maybe ila ata tembe 6,000 a month, times 12. Umwana sasa? So uungeza kwa hiyo 60, uungeza 70, equal 72,000 a year. Bado kwa the same tax bracket. Alafu ulipe tax, alafu ingini baki kwa bizna. Sa, tumeboro 10,000. Sona baki na 90. Kwa 100,000, walipa 15% kwa taxes. Na baki tume na 80,000. Kwa business, December 31st. Umelipa bills zako. Kwa ta kama uko single, uko puwa sana. Ama kama uko na wife and income, uko puwa sana. Business wa baki na 80,000. Yo 80,000 January, kama nisa mene this year, 2025, 2026 January you'll have enough money to buy another truck. 80,000 will need down payment to buy trucks straight forward. That are no question to ask. With the dealership, they'll happily give you. By the way, I'm on a truck with the dealership this weekend. I'm on a dealership the last two weekends, by the way. That's why we can't be very busy. Ini, by the way, by the way, I'm on a truck with the blue, come three weeks ago, I'm on four weeks ago. I'm on a truck with red, three weeks ago. Kapeleka track yangu, hii ingine ya red, hii ya muendesha, two weeks ago. Last week, ya tena this weekend, ya peleka hii ya red, ilikuwa na repair tena, belt ilikatika. So, ni mekuwa dealership the last four weeks back to back, even it cost dough every single time. But hiyo ni expenses, hiyo is the big deal, hiyo na ungeo story badai. So, usha mua, okay, exactly, this is how much I'm going to pay myself. Now, pati ya scenario, by the way. Alafu seme, okay, now I know the figures. But then, mi nakambia, easy figures nakambia, is as accurate as possible kwa track moja. Si ungei track tatu, mina track tatu, track moja. So you can even tell. Kama mina track moja and I'm able to make an income enough ya ku, ya for a livelihood, track tatu je, yu ni extra. Mwanda. Kini track moja kukua account ya wife. Je pia ye na mlipa kama employee, na mkreati employment pia. Nipo kwa na yu employment juu na kama uko, you're a civil member of the society, citizen. You're a noble citizen. Kwa mwanda lipa taxes, Masama, oh, but you're paying taxes twice. Yeah, uki okay, anayo rauti ngini ya kutajilipa, utakuwa poa, utalibaki na 160, alafu utalipa yu tax ya business 15% ya 160. It's, it, for the records, ni poa kuwa na kusho you're making money, kisabu kuna vitu flani za hii level ya employee, uta benefit as an employee, si as a business owner. So you're killing two birds with one stone. Ukuna business income na kuna personal income. Ina kusaidia sana by the way. Kaku nuwa hao, hao angalia personal income. Ok, angalia business income, you how let me go how a business alafu utalipa 20% down but if some personal they'll only ask for 3% minimum to 10% uko your choices so the poko jilipa kulipa ile employee w2 na business at the same time taxes ni maisha i don't see try to avoid sawa usha moyo kila kila kitu so napata mshambi amse kila kitu mpatia fact mpatia kila kitu umekaa chini ume take your time ku watch channel the last how many minutes to monge story half an hour to monge story how the track makes money na kila kitu so alafu msema okay so what's stopping me alafu naanza wait a minute ah uh, last time kujaribu kitu kingine kuingiana this time so yourself sabotaging yourself usha usha decide nimepata figures nimepiga hesabu yangu ime make sense perfectly makes sense then msema okay then why aren't you taking action Unanza, ah, uh, unajua mazini kwa chuo badu, alafu job yangu, alafu watui, alafu madhe. You're self-sabotaging your efforts ya kusaksin. Just imagine. I don't, I don't know why people do that. It's like you're shooting yourself in the foot. You're self-sabotaging 
your progress. Konini, you're trying to, you're giving yourself reasons why you don't want to do the thing that you need to do anyway. Alafu na shanga mbona wasa, you know, wakana do, you know, wakana do. The only difference ya mtu wako poor na mtu wako rich, ni hile, the rich, it's just some wealth, ni hile some rich. The rich, they tried something. Wali, wali make hile effort, some, let me just try this out. No, no. Awa gini wali ogopa, they chickened out. How could follow some, wali, wali give up before, and <laughs> so anyway, so I'll you. So I'm going to give you an example like they know. Ni aji albo, kama unajua clear, kama unajua clear debt ya help, inaweza hinda usifike maju na green card. That's not even a question, by the way. I'm, I'm, thank you for asking the question, but ni kama self-sabotage. That's not even a question. Why don't you just apply for the green card and wait and see? example to thank you for the for asking the question it's a really good question but just make sure you see borderline it's karibu na ile self sabotaging because watu wengi awaga so convinced to do something alafu unaji sabotage wenyewe they they wanajidanga yani wanafanya nasemaje ni kama unaji convince you have all the facts and everything alafu unaji convince oh maybe this is not the right time Maybe it's just so they talk Kenya, so they can't do it. I've never left my country, so it's a good opportunity. Me na samanga, me me come a living example. Me so come so come up a come a study, so come up a come a visiting B one B two, so come come a cruise ship, so come come a media personality, so come come a somebody's spouse. Me me come na green card peke angu. Konini in the confines of my loneliness, Kenya ni kido job multiple holidays. Me li apply green card two thousand and five. Me li apply. I was selected in the second side, in the appeal. I was like, I didn't know what I was doing. I was like, people just knew, I'll go in the States. Nothing happens. 2006, because I was like, I'll go in the States. I think it was 2004. The DV was like DV2007. So, meaning, the results were like 2006. By 2007, wait, 2006, October. Ndiyo walitoa hizo, ndiyo zilikuwa announce. Nipata nini yangu January, by the way, 2007. Ndiyo nipata hile, by the previous year, kwa nisha juwa nisha pata green card. But hile pipa kuenda embassy, hile kama January. Actually, kani menda ku home, form ni hile na familia. By that time, mbuye likuwa kisumu. The whole family likuwa kisumu. Except my sister likuwa states already. So, kutoka kurudi back to Nairobi, likuwa na post office huko Els Lassie Avenue. Nika fungua mail, ile kutafuta bills ikali pestima na maji na vitu kama hizo nikaanisha alone alafu nikapata barua moja ya sisi kwa ngali hivi ni jina langu sasa sisi soma sai kinisha kwa backpack yangu nikaenda my business ni kama where exactly where I was exactly what I was doing ni ana pale i think sijui ni tuanga ICDC tower something like that kuna mali ko open feel hivi kama kama square hivi kuna kama mawe imeka hapo chini mali ko op bank nikaja ta hapo nyuma nisikumbuki hiyo jina ni tuanze nikafungua hiyo basi nikaanza kusoma kwa ngali hivi nafa kwenda embassy in 5 days I didn't know what to do. Because the ambiam to your kid can again. You can talk Kenya come chairs or you can talk to Kenya come chairs or you. So I didn't ask myself, what about my job? What about my uh uh ili quit Nikwa Shula by the Nikwananga evening class business administration school? Nikwa Kenya Institute of Management. In track of building Sabu Nikwana do job full time, but kwana evening class available. So someone then the Kenya Institute of Management. I got a diploma, I left the track when I came to the University of Nairobi while I'm working. Flexible school. I can graduate eventually. So what is it? I was more valuable. I was like, I will look beyond multiple holidays. I was like, I have a degree enough so that multiple holidays are going to promote within the company. So I was like, I invest in my company. All my dreams were cut short in the green card. I left the trajectory of the job that I wanted to do. I came to Kenya. It was maybe a white collar job, very high level white collar job, compared to blue collar truck driving in America. I don't know the difference there, sir. So it's crazy. Mom ka four hours away, na chapa job paka na na rudi homes do eight or nine. No, no, sir. Long hours. Lakini, English because any example yangu, it doesn't have to be your experience. This is my experience. Actually, when I started to, me me nikuwa I was figuring out as I go, where me na kumbi edi vitu kuna hizo ma details step by step. So, so I came to a white collar job. I became an employee. I was not going advance. But because I chose a route different, I became a green card. I was a tracking, a blue collar job. The difference is, I make so much money without 
a, a college degree ni kidu tracking trajectory yangu my personal experience than ngeko kimme kama ningepata hiyo degree no no difference in my experience yours could be absolutely totally different usi di compare na mimi ile tu acha ni mimi ni inspiration just in case so ukisema everything you do kama ni ku apply green card very seriously understand exactly the require what they require of you what do they require of you you know the best is some evil i love some i will do to the best when you go picture kwa studio somebody who knows what they are doing sababu kumbuka mimi nakambi kweli kabisa nimekuja good work tumoza every field kwa hii life every let's say field kama example ya career field speciality kuna nuance ya kila kitu by the way kama siku za how do you manage your truck albert ngita ku explain you to realize kuna nuance nuance na manishani what's the word for nuance ile kuna details kuna ile details iko hidden always do unless you're in the industry so mimi nikiongea na ongea kama in one minute nitakupatia game yote ya tracking in one minute hivi ile nime accumulate over the years kuna nuance so msana napiga picha kuna specific things and i do a ile wewe doing kama ni msa casual so mood a little bit of mood double i'm on double you don't like doubling in photography in a way na jo kuna differences ya lens na focal length kila kitu na zijuza zote so just don't waste your time enda kwa studio apiga picha that seriousness ya kitu moja hiyo approaching everything seriously na ile nuance ta kusaidia alafu pata hiyo the same same thing hiyo nitwaje picha ikuepoa kabisa then you go to the application and say okay ni mwaje video albo alijaza hivi mimi na, najaza exactly the way i did if i did the same thing i'm asking you to do and ni come through meaning ata kama nilikuwa najaribu jaribu nili hit the nail on the head nili nili pata exactly the way it was so i can bring up hivi so now that i'm sitting here talking to you hiyo ndio ile difference ya kuja stress na green card na kutakuwa hapa hivi states hiyo ndio difference by the way na siwezi kuwa nime achieve it my personal example so take everything seriously piga picha kwa studio alafu kama useme hivi don't self sabotage useme ati suppose hii suppose hata kuuliza maswali mengi and afanye hivi the most important thing ni hivi kirudisha hiyo screen ile ya kushare ndio hii angalia kuja kama tuseme kuja hapa kwa hii screen inasema nini hapa hivi kuna ile imesema hapa hivi dv instructions sawa hata usiuliza swali mingi kama ni mseno je msemaje kuna two things you utakujua vitu kwa hiyo world how do you learn things the best way to learn new things ni kusoma kitabu kwa nini when you reading a book ni wewe na book it's an intimate moment by the way ni intimate na za some easy words kama ni bora kwa mtu by the way si zangu sema ti alboni writer ni, when you reading a book ni intimate ni wewe na hiyo book there's nobody else kwa hiyo picha utafungua pages you'll use your senses difference ya kus ku listen you could be doing something and listening you ni passively kuna msemi sikia last week hivi ya samati kama mind yet you think twice kuna vitu mbili kwa mind ile the things that you do every day sometimes you speak to yourself ndio ile yani you you're wondering you're pondering you're wondering in your head unajuliza maswali you're having a conversation with yourself so kwa hii ni kwa podcast alisema hivi the part of the brain that inaongea na wewe ile communication ni ile conscious conscious mind so to become a jina sijui majina by the way ningeongea tu ile niko nasikiza conscious mind you can have a conversation with your conscious mind kwa nini ina communication na wewe your conscious mind is an extension of your mouth whatever your mind unaongea kama kile naongea sasa hii i'm interacting with my conscious mind lakini kuna subconscious mind subconscious mind does not communicate with you through words ina communicate na emotions muona sasa that's why kuna hiyo difference so kama if the some self sabotaging ile where you must you fail in your subconscious mind so you've trained your subconscious mind that you are a failure so every time una kwa presented na challenge una arouse your subconscious mind ya failure alafu your conscious mind conversations like well, i'm going i'm going to do this i'm going to do this but your subconscious mind in a doubt in a summer no you're always a failure so even you listen <laughs> you need self sabotaging as you change your mindset some aje when your subconscious mind which communicates in emotions we am be hey listen subconscious mind sababu kumbuka whatever you take in is what you get out kwa subconscious mind so so my book ndio sema hivyo kuna difference when you mtu asema ngaje asema kama any words in borokwa actually me borrow these words either listening to somebody ama kwa book okay kama na drive track mostly za audio books i'll be honest with you sababu siezi borrow some book kama na drive track 
but nda buy your book anyway kwa nini when you're reading a book unatumia all your senses all your five senses in a sense sababu your eyes your senses ni sight sight ni moja sight ni your eyes you're looking at the book alafu your nose you're smelling the book you can smell the pages as you flip the pages so alafu your mouth sometimes unaongea you're speaking to your conscious mind while reading the book ama you sometimes mtu usoma kama usoma unaisoma kabisa wow electrical diversity visa you're speaking while you're reading so alafu unasikiza you're listening hiyo sound ile ile atmosphere kama nimesemaje sasa hivi sema when i went niliko hivyo ni Kalslas Avenue nikachukua ile bahasha ya green card ikisema nimefa kwenda embassy within few days five days by january 6th nimefa kwenda embassy guess what nilikaa chini kaisoma i was speaking to myself kachizi by the way kaunga ile album nini bana album bana najiongelesha i was i was having a conversation with my conscious mind so so my subconscious mind what it made me think because said you're a green card before sababu my uncle alipata a green card yeye kwanza ni anambia apply your kitu you never know apply i didn't take any interest nika apply so subconscious mind you works na emotions that's what some ukienda kwa interview for example in ni in kwa skizo hizo akisema hivyo ukienda kwa interview wala sana unataka kutafutia job sometimes they look at you the way you're dressed the, the your demeanor you need subconscious mind kwa sababu subconscious mind you communicate na emotions in yani in a show outwards ayongei kama say you are sad subconscious mind it is my you are sad somebody looks at your facial other before say my word i share the communication we communicate without words you need subconscious mind so don't self sabotage yourself kama za kujikuwa na hiyo failure mimi kilioni fungua akili mara mob ni hii story za kuso my books by the way you know but i have so many concepts in my mind so some which one can relate to this one nafungua nafungua hii mind i'm all, i'm flipping the book in my mind alaza uda pale labda nimechangalikiwa sura yangu inakafani na kaa hivi na face yangu iko all over all over the corner because i'm speaking to my subconscious mind umeona sasa that's why i say please stop self sabotaging yourself kuwa na ile winning mindset no matter what where where apply i mean to the poor cause labda nimeramble sana what do you have to lose trample some like to pia kwa ardhi yake african americans what do you have to lose anyway you know somebody what do you have to lose uki apply uki endo pigwe picha sawa when you apply green card alafu usipate then what ulijipatia 110% you tried you iko ingiana sawa so now some okay what's my plan b what can i try alboya ongea juu ya visiting what can i try visiting when the visiting unyimwe visa useme oh mazeni li west do never think of asama it's like it's really somangaje don't cry over spilled milk itongaje kitu kama hiyo ikimwike mwagika do mtu mia do sikile muse asia kuchaka saa zingine i feel like do it up come na itaenda usiwoya touch hiyo do ulikuwa nayo last time kama ndio the end of your life sababu ma touch do na livelihood yako mazeni ni sacrifice oh man usijali sana itapita tu hiyo itapita do it come na itaenda Sometimes nakuwa kama mimi niko Kenya niko broke for so long. Niko do job multiple holidays, siko na degree niko ndio iko in between college na kila kitu. Niko kama I do computer science diploma something like that. Nifa kwenda UK kumaliza hiyo education, siko na hiyo job. Sometimes after job kwanza, I was in between things. Lakini did I ever go to UK kumaliza computer science? No, I did not. Nika end up states na green card. Zero clean slate, something that was never in my radar. Sasa so, hata sahimu sema naangalia Saturday na Sunday. Niko tu na different place hai. Sawa, hebu tuone. Eh uh, turudi back to my question. Na na TikTok nimesahau kama na TikTok baada ya kabisa nimesahau. Kamera ime face yellow side. So kuna some comments in this live were filtered to protect the community experience. Okay, so dinami comment nini? Kasa there so many passport photo up unless to show ni gani. Peter Peace. Apps ni mingi by the way. What did I just say? Enda kuwa electric electronic diversity visa program. Uko TikTok au wewe jua kama t- ni YouTube. Uende kuwa hiyo page yenyewe nasema nini? Kuna DV to 2026 instructions. Click hiyo. Kaa chini soma. Ukiona okay, umekuwa distracted, walk away, take a walk and come back. Soma tena. Wacha kuangalia apps mingi. Apps si application. DV ni kitu ya US Department of State period and according website yao angalia instructions alafu exactly what it says do whatever it says to do that's it 
Hata na story nyingine. Sawa, usikirie mara mbili, sema hivyo ndio self sabotage. Hata kuje self sabotage. Information is available. Miki what I'm doing ile I'm I'm kama kama na enhance information. There's nothing different. Actually information yangu ya DV nimefungua website mbele yangu hapa. Sasa kwa YouTube unaniona. Labda nimeka nimeka hapa. Naweza yaka kwa page hapa bado. Unaona? Iko hapa yote the whole page ndio hii. This information yangu by the way, don't get me wrong. Everything ndio hapa iko available. Go to the website original. So my instructions. Alafu the best thing hivi kama study. Ukiona kizungu ya America is aingiani poa and can you swali ile ask yourself those questions uandike chini alafu hata nitumie nitumie comment kwa hii video comment ni poa kwa sababu kama siezi answer maybe niko job man niko busy tuesday somebody will see the comment and they'll answer you muona sasa kwa sababu mimi mwangambia wife naambia wife sometimes e king goes away states and then throw off kidogo naambia what does this mean exactly and so alafu anambia alafu anambia i was so close but ni kama nilichanganisha ndio nimezoea ile background yangu ni kizungu ya Kenya ile based on British English. American is slightly different, slightly too, but in the same. So just go to the original, go to the source we saw me. Kile mimi nafanya ile I'm trying to make it easier. Ni kama nachukua the same information, alafu na relay. No no, regurgitating. Naitonga hivyo. I'm getting the information, alafu na kama na watupia tena the same same information. Ndio mse ana feel kama me give up, as a give up, aenda yanga it kwa the second time. I apply. Kwa sababu ki apply hivi, next year tutakuwa na yeye hapa hivi live. Kama atakaa Minnesota. Unaona sasa? Kama nitajambia sijui ni sema mbona last week ni nilimit na nani Kenya na American home alikuja hapa hivi Minnesota kwa in business meeting alikam Wednesday Thursday Friday tuliongea na yeye Monday tuka meet Friday ilikuwa very weird siko na time sana mbia unaweza mind ukam kwa track <laughs> nani uh, Owen alikam kwa track to limit for the first time the day meet Owen mungu ajua yake but na feel kama mjua so tulikuwa na yeye hata video nda drop video maybe this week come next week nitaka a lot of editing kwa tunaongea tu by the way kuna kitu yote video alikam Minnesota alitoka hapa Wednesday kama 5 pm hivi so to limit na yeye last week atunge meet alikam kwa truck don't be too just the best you can do kuja kwa truck to drive na yeye sababu niko on the clock akakam akaona at least your flow maybe pia me learn something so so ndio hivyo bana so ile ile you never know you never really know so tuendele kwa swali ya enda kwa source out of the source mwenyewe mimi na relate to exactly the information that's already available alafu labda ndako challenge u take your action kwa poa kabisa so actually mazina swali za tiktok ataka raka juu atwezi list kwa screen hapa hivi it's really hard to get loads when you set up a self when you set up as a self employed person uni team Kenya USA labda nafanya over the road siji kama anajua kile mu fanya hapa hivi unaona sasa alafu sema blue collar business in the US can women get into trucking and how user ana jina yeah the, my wife has a cdl license unajua hivyo my wife i'm a drive i'm a drive truck kama 3 years my kids were getting older alafu kupata mwingine so ndio sahi she's not driving anymore sababu kuna kama one year old home but because of the experience and learn what happens next ana manage truck yake mmoja pia anasaidia yeah, kumanage yangu nyingine Mwana sasa. Mim, my truck zangu ni kama passive income kwa sababu I don't make money for, by driving that truck anymore. Somebody drives that truck, it pays for itself, it pays the driver, it pays the bills. Whatever is left over the mina keep. Ni passive income number one. So, so as a woman it's possible. Sijui ndio kabiaje, labda uja watch video mob. Mara mingi kama kwa nimeenda ku post TikTok this year actively. Last year niko too, I didn't even know what to do, but niko na post TikTok soon. I, I'm still trying to figure out how I can relay message to TikTok iko short. Sababu YouTube mume allow shorts iko 3 minutes from the 15th of this month. So TikTok inataka kama 1 hour hivi kwa explain kila kitu. Na mwoga exclusive inaongea Kiswahili, sasa kuongea Kingoso kabisa. Sababu I'm trying to reach a certain audience. No no. Hii ni watu wa watu wa home. Hakuna story hapo watu wa home. Au wengine ni shauri yao. So man cave ndani kama kawaida. Uni my cost cost Oh my RSG my cost my cost stronghold okay I mean Chaganisha so so kuna ile maish asema if you've made application for a job and different info with the one from the green card can it affect I don't think so say angle instructions a green card what what to compare apples and oranges una hivyo what to compare green card ni Uweza kuwa kuna hivi hata Owen akasema hivi Owen alisema hivi Kenya American home by the way Owen alisema hivi 
unaweza kwa huko states unaishi states ulikamkama today by the way na ongea juu ya Victor best yangu Victor uko states umekamkama F1 student you are in school in America as a student F1 status apply for the green card still kwa nini if you win utafanya change of status that's it you don't have to go to Kenya utaenda uta apply change of status utafuta lawyer wa immigration anakusaidia you could be in America already kama visa ingine tu unatembea manini lakini you can change you can win green card sababu green card ni straight up citizenship bila ile process nyingine mingi ile muone sasa lazima uwe mtu kuwe sponsored mara zio kuwe sponsored na mtu mwingine hiyo story yote hiyo solve upata green card ume skip 10 steps ahead umesema ile kama monopoly uh, go pass go collect 20 dollars and don't go to jail uko na jail free umezunguka hiyo board mzima one lap bila bila ni kama ume you have yote ume avoid ndio green card hata kama wewe ni F1 student na kwa US saa hii uko US apply green card kama ulienda Dubai kwa do job apply green card kama unaishi Canada na unakuja states apply green card it doesn't matter iko open to all sababu eligibility yako ni your country of birth sawa hata kama unaishi states already which country were you born in Kenya sawa apply mimi siwezi apply mimi raia itakuwa unfair hata sijui itakuwa weird that's what kama ingekuwa ingekuwa possible ni za kwa laba ni crime sijui i don't want to do it lakini za kwa laba ni crime apply green card it's a quicker way kukuwa na uraia mimi nimeanza business na green card but then nilikuwa raia i was rich already <laughs> kama nilikuwa rich sijasema wealth ni sema rich i'm still working on my wealth maybe stay at your wealth ni sababu ndako i'm going to die before i'm i'm wealthy but my kids are going to be wealthy sababu wata continue your legacy ile legacy ya, yangu so how to buy a truck unachukua pesa unaenda kwa dealership alafu unawapatia alafu unakupatia truck na side documents that's it <laughs> that's like a simplify kuna story ya ku buy truck by the way hii ni tiktok swali ya nani user alafu that's it hakuna kitu kingine hapa tiktok as a woman it's the same thing hakuna difference kama una news ati how how does a man uh, as a man how do i get a nursing degree so na shule so in the same thing tunaenda shule alafu kenda shule is kwa labda ile tu historically nursing ni mostly career ya women from the 60s 70s lakini siku hizi kuna wale kama majiu majiu male au prefer male nurse hivyo tu ni culture kuna wasa kwa hivyo so because of siku hizi kama hata tuchali waingia shule fanya dini mostly yote kama na hii RN RN ni kama two year two year uh, uh, ukienda chuo na nursing program 2 years na kwa RN registered nurse ukienda leo kwa bachelor of nursing bachelor of science in nursing you need degree kuna ile ni masters in jongaji bsn nimesai nimesai zama terms anyway actually na think nikiongea the same time so it's the same thing you do whatever you want to do hakuna ati sijui ati kuna specifications au fanya hivi na hivi na ile if you want to know how to do dv and out some instructions read instructions anything una doubt write it down alafu uliza kama uliza kwa swali hapa hivi guarantee ukiwacha comment kwa hii video somebody will answer you ula na what jumue kama tags like mwe kama tags by the way in ile relate ni vitu content yangu ni swahili so sababu i'm specifically na target audience flani no na nimesema hivyo nimesema information yangu ni ni selfishly na target audience flani ya east africa ama any swahili speaking individual na anajua english kidogo kuna sa english au alewa pia lakini target yangu ni very specific mu target specific demographic na target so really speaking people that's why sababu hiyo ni ino sadi muongea comfortable kwa nini mfanye hivyo ni muona ma watu wengine kwa ukifundisha mbwa green card na kiluga yao kama kuna moja ya Ethiopia kabisa kuna moja yani kuna people are doing it in their own na kwa youtube search green card videos most of them ni foreign languages kwa nini sababu green card is more applicable kwa watu wanaishi outside america muona sasa kwa nini ni program na track ikuwe melting pot. Sasa ngo ngia story ya America, labda ndo ngia baadaye, ndo kama ngia story ya America baadaye. But in short ile, ikisafiri in short ni ile, e country ilikuwa brand new country, ilikuwa established na watu wa British. Waliingia hapa na 13 colonies, ilikuwa 15 colonies, alafu ikaweza kuitwa United States of America. Ilikuwa 13 states originally, ilikuwa 15 states. Hata ma 13 number 13 sijui ni number funny weird. Kitu kama hiyo alafu waka by Louisiana purchase from the French kuliko na Native Americans wakoishi hapo already by the way don't forget that waliuliwa wote na smallpox 
waka clear land wali kuna ile kwa annex walichukua tu land hii ni yetu mtadu mtadu ni yetu wakachukua land coast to coast no one has kwa united states so you country originally kwa immigrants wow native americans wale wao kwa mexicans au ndio native americans ama itonga aztec empire au ndio native americans kuna cherokee kuna tribe mingi siku hizi kama hapa minnesota tuna tribe ngapi nne kuna the band of ojibwe ni mispronunciation but our native americans are in north of minnesota karibu na lake superior wanapanda hiyo karibu na lake flight wa lake msaio jina lake msaio jina milak lake milak milak wanaishi huko hivyo alafu kuna lakota dakota na kota hizo ni tribes by the way south dakota hiyo jina dakota ni tribe north dakota hiyo ni tribe pia au ibeni ni vile tu territory yao iko separated na hizo ma states but the dakota people wanaishi around the mississippi river na minnesota river zinaanzia north dakota zina kuja hivi hiyo ni yani hao kwa hizo territories zao just like unapata kuna msomali mkenya msomali 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 mu ethiopia kwa nini the british will create country only was separate na hizo ma country borders makumbuka huyu ni mkoloni before kuko na border ilikuwa tu land so so because hii ni growing economy hao takaikuwa mix na kila mtu kwa sababu before ilikuwa empty alafu wala watu walikuwa europe kwa migrate hapa hivi hawana ile initiative any more sababu europe siku hizi ni kama iko different than it was before ilikuwa ilikuwa different sijui nisemaje which word is akwa community guidelines such like some other zero but excuse me they are really interested sana unless country yenyewe iko na war ndio watu migrate huko hivyo sawa so kwa hivyo unapata people from different places wako hapa wako in melting pot wao bring ile speciality yao mostly ni labor ni labor after labor labor that's also minimum ni high school baku japa hiyo mara mingi unapata ile band ya immigrants hapo japa one year after five years au kwa wamekuwa wame advance yani immigrants wako na more motivation ya kuwa hard than wale natives wala wako hapa already so you know kama sasa mimi itakuwaaje msafiri kutoka Kenya 14 years ago ndio kuna small business owner na na, na my employee kwa nini niko na ile niko na drive ya, ya my drive iko more sina ile ni tajiri trauma trauma ya slavery sina hiyo trauma ya slavery maybe kuna ile colonialism but mimi nimezoea kama colonialism shaisha kanya ku independent in quote independent anyway in terms of government self government lakini financially bado tuko still colonized anyway msa mtu kweli kuna hakuna story lakini ni ile unakuja hapa hivi uko more motivated kwa sababu unakam na structure flani you have nothing you got to have something so uko more motivated na mtu local ada watu wangu watajua juu au kuona ile party ngine kama wa somali na pata msomali walikam kama refugee hapa hivi wako was due 7 year old saa hii mwingine ako kwa US United States Congress Ilhan Omar alikuwa slave alikuwa nini alikuwa refugee ada nani aniambia oh ina kwa somana Ilhan Omar kole alikuwa na kole she was still political by the way so ni kitu amefaruru career yake anyway tiktok to madam swali kwa mob sana How's South Dakota as a starting place? You know that anyway by the way, it doesn't matter. But it's quite different. It's quite it has less people, less population, less people. Population of Dakota I think ni 1.5 million the whole state. Wale watu considered your state. Kuna native Americans are different. I was part of uh, your state government. Alafu kuna nini nyingine? Minnesota kuko maybe 5.6 million population ya hapa maybe illinois is doing up 18 million yani kuna states na more people states na less people that's why easy states kuna less people they like immigrants sababu wana build economy yao inakuwa yani they have jobs but they don't have people to work the jobs mbona sasa so how encourage my immigrants ndio sababu wazungu washa settle wala kwa east coast hapa mo midwest ni mashambani but north dakota you can unaweza anzia huko pia lakini je kuja minnesota anyway you'll, you'll get more people So how to buy a truck or oh, just maybe of course i'm assuming one doesn't have full amount kuna kuna there's a way una tafuta loan you talk to lazima uko na mostly truck lazima uanze na somaje sometimes truck ni kitu ni blue collar job blue collar job is very simple you go to school and train two years hivi truck ni one month by the way one month imetosha maybe excuse me three months at most kama unaingia kole semester a half a semester but tracking in one month in the commercial side kwa shule 3 months hivi one semester itakuwa spread out alafu utakuwa na more training alafu ukianza job two things 
kama if if you you plan to the tracking sasa sasa maybe for man sasa leo tracking is very tricky if you want to be an owner an owner operator ile you have your own truck you drive your own truck don't work for a big company find a small company kama ya albo kwa nini sababu mimi you want to be with somebody who's doing the thing you desire to do sa ukina kwa kampuni kama iko fanya kazi swift swift is one of ama it is the largest the truck with the largest fleet in america i think it still is swift so we, they keep buying other companies let's not struggle alafu wanazia acquires na kwa zao so swift is uh, ilinua us express by the way it had nuas jini karibu imechukua karibu all the in absorb all the companies is one of the biggest companies so swift transportation i will never i will never come across ile structure how the business is running konini i'm just a number mimi ni employee number i'm a truck number i don't exist lakini like the trucking construction i was working for somebody one person the owner alikuwa na small fleet two or three trucks hivi tulikuwa watatu one two three tulikuwa watatu so yeah, yeah when the, the way he's managing his business daily affairs is exactly what i'm doing sabu ni land through yeah so so you have to decide if you want to work corporate american a big trucking company end up in a big trucking company but if you want to start your own business kwa hired them to a small fleet kwa nini itakuwa hands on daily expense kwa sababu pata yeye ndio ceo yeye ndio accountant yeye ndio so uta learn you learn more by working with a small company than a big company kwa big company muko wengi kuna level isha kwa structured already it's automated so so somewhere how do i buy a truck maybe as a kupata license go work for somebody with a small fleet with family owned uta learn more than a big company so so a big company they'll keep you busy but they'll pay you less small company will pay you more because more valuable you're part of the the backbone of the company so you mean prefer work for somebody for one year alafu you know vocational by the way if you're a plumber for example you have a two year two year degree with plumber you'll go work for a company the things you do as a plumber ile you'll be working for somebody utakoingia kwa nyumba ya mtu una repair vitu so when you decide to start your own business ile ile experience you may get you experience costs it doesn't even if you go lonely paid you're not paid well but you're getting experience it go more valuable than getting paid well and not getting any experience more stable so you want to work for a small family owned company you learn more than a big company then utalan how did you buy your truck mwambie mada zangu everything wanakimbia hey alba how much is this truck namwambia this much how much does it cost you for fuel and beer this month everything how much are tires any any question my drivers ask i tell them ala nishangaa mmoja akasema ati albert how much is your truck it can be 120 i want to buy it can be i'm not selling is it really 120 can be yeah, it's 120 alafu kada kuliza mse mwingine kama confirm kama truck ni 120 can be well you never know his truck has this has that it's possible actually that's cheap kuna truck ya 150 kuna truck ya 200000 so most of my all the information i don't really hide anything konini kama ni uliza genuinely ata mimi i learn from somebody i learn from experience so maswali but page yenyewe ndio hii kama utakuwa apply na ongea juu ya apply i'm selling a 2019 box truck 26 foot truck sg somebody is buying that sg why are you selling una utakuwa tie mtu problems zingine sg ama ama una move on Ndio swali wapi ya sasa swali zimejani aje ile wa check kwa odeno deno deno iko wapi na kwa youtube sasa sasa nimemaza ya tiktok deno iko wapi but we see we self sabotage so kuna uh, al habib ali asema i'm locked bro okay sasa hiyo ni mweka comment ya kila mtu facebook unajua ku multitask na ni kujaribu tu bana bini kujaribu tu Uh, hello albo tuko ndani kabisa oh, feel feel na kuona gato uh, like live for engagement uh, it would like video by the way say like video musa kusema kitu sidi kwa nini nafaka posta please like the video ivo ina said engagement in keep active especially tiktok it has mika but siko hapa sana niko na repair na fuck fanya track before jioni uh, antenna ilivunjika isha fixiwa half but the other half me na mzana naye i was trying to save myself money So now na leo una multitask. Oh, in the beginning niko na. <laughs> Can you show us how that app uh, looks like? Ziko several. 
si kuna mob sana several ile tu ya picha lakini mimi sema hivi just to make it simple unajua don't try and reinvent the wheel kama wheel in exist tafuta studio and upigwe picha na professional apige picha ile passport size i don't know how much it costs it's quite expensive this thing is worth your life wazana ulipe sijuni how much 100 kenya shillings kwa hiyo picha alafu come states na opportunity to make 1 million dollars in 3 4 years from today muona sasa so you underestimate your cost so you are pinyeni to a kuna mob sana by the kuna mingi but don't in nasema tu example ile tu ya ku verify picture go to the official website you could next to my screen up hapo ni to a dv program dot state si states state dot gov and I want the instructions I'm going to follow instructions specifically step by step. Let me go through the video last week. And I go through tena by the way. Ki para time kidogo. And and across instructions. And across studio pigwa picha. Kuja kwa application. If you want me to print you the application, I should she me rearrange kwa word documents. Ndio kwa PDF. Takutumia email. Yaani you'll have this questions before you open the website. Ile tu yani you can sababu nimegundua website after studio how long in a shut down. So ni tafuta ile mtu ame yani kuna hiyo layout uyangalie prior prior to going to fill. So if you have your photo ready and you have your answers ready ukifungua website hivi ni kuenter tu done alafu unatuma. Na upload picha alafu unatuma inaenda tu hivi na maliza. Kama una una computer utaenda kwa maybe cyber cafe na ile thumb drive. Inaongaje USB stick inaongaje sio itaongaje ile 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 memory. <laughs> sita kwa thumb drive huko nimesa ile jina kitambo ikitangaje kitangaje Kenya nimesa jina thumb drive uweke picha hapo ama kama uko na email usitumie email alafu uende we download kwa hiyo computer ufunge computer we tume usawa hiyo story yende that's it anything else will cost you money but it's totally worth it utaelewa sawa enda kwa official na sababu tu kuna kuna app but go to the official website naona guru tafuta guru visuals and the story a picture and I'm trust I can vouch for him I'll pick a picture so Tony Saiba already applied now we leave everything to God Mungu mbele mtu ako avoid hiyo jina kama Mungu mbele sababu squeezy I mean to be honest kabisa hata kusema wewe ni Christian whatever watu wanga hypocrites so ni kama your god is unatumia hiyo jina kama excuse ya kusema I did things wrong but I hope I don't feel you parting I don't think that's how it works give your best actually mu naweza sema siko very vast mimi na understanding biblia hiyo by the way kama nyemu understand biblia biblia ina all over the place kiangalia new testament old testament kuna vitu mbovu za biblia za kuwa inconsistent consistent i make sense by the way anybody who says the bible is the word of god like go straight na kuna kitu mbaya nayo musema ah unasoma bible by the way unasoma you in up and down kuna kuna different faces na kila kitu Alafu pia kumbuka kuna, kuna story ya uh, I'm being honest by the way. Si ati kama una offended, si I'm not si, I'm not trying to knock you down. Nimesema tu my observation. Ukiangalia Genesis chapter 1 2 3. <laughs> kuna story blina what some one explain ni kama ni kama ni, ni differences. Juu ni una zoom in, unaanza na wide, alafu una zoom in, alafu una zoom in. Sawa in that aspect. But somebody said that. But ukweli kabisa ni ile hiyo ngai inconsistent in a way sababu kama kusema ile from 16th century nasema 16 something 16 century something nasema 1601 sawa tuseme 1601 when shakespeare existed when the king of england was king james waliandika bible yao ili the king james version sawa alafu suri ya king james specifically king james naonge jua king james see the bible king james mwenye alisema hivi alisema alikuwa he was doubling in uh, the stock market what is the stock market kind of makes sense do your community guidelines stock market like was slave trade by the way so the stock market so the stock market was making a lot of money you know generate your level by the utumwa so so i got translate bible into the king james why did he translate the bible to king james kuna reason behind that too out of kiriangi story so but the word of god is infallible all the nice words Please do your studies. Attend to the Nigerian TV. Instead of in Guinea, 
hata kabla nita come sema naangalia cyber ambia tu story kidogo small history Casa Grande yeye ni akona bunge story alien confirmia hivi Roy Casa Grande so kama umsa alikuwa ndio king of england ali ali separate from the catholic church wakuwa na the church of england which is a monarchy at the same time you can attach and state together so behind your king the head of the church and the head of the state alafu ka publish bible yake they have to kwa nini so meaning aki akikuwa na aki publish bible yake lazima itakuwa na bias fulani kwa nini ata, ata, ata include some words in that bible ili ita justify why he is the head of the church and the head of the state at the same time in the 16th century by the way when the stock market was going on so stock market ni jina yetu ya leo kumbuka ina maana utumwa so alikuwa involved na hiyo utumwa the first town in america iko maryland and it was in it was uh, it was jamestown hapo ndio utumwa wote kwa ningili hapo hivyo so so kusoma biblia yake vile imeandikwa hiyo translation ukisoma mabasi za utumwa zina emphasize utumwa ukisoma ile nyingine ya before that iko itwa geneva bible iko different from king james 16th century geneva bible so kuna ile inconsistency ni kama ile favorite words church and state story yake alafu because he was the king na england likuwa na power the most authorized kumbuka authorized ni ile the king had power king akisema i want your child for marriage today akisema amesema hata kuna si si parliament si si negotiation unapatiana hivyo hivyo i want your land ime go missing hivyo hivyo unaona sasa so ukiangalia aspect ni ile kuwa yani let me understand this story what to the story in short kabisa niambie na ongea story in the future hii mambo ya green card this time ni hivi use your critical mind critical thinking ujiulize mtu atakuwa bias sababu unajua wewe una, unaangalia parliament unaangalia watu parliament mtu anaingia kwa ofisi na sawa kila kitu use your critical mind logically ujiulize do you think that the bible needs to be biased towards the church of england you tell me mkwache hiyo swali ujiulize mwenyewe do you think in his right mind sababu kuna jamestown maryland kwa colonies ni kwa one of the colonies jamestown alikuwa afanya na stocks ada of course itakuwa directed to that so any verse imende kwa dio tumo kwa biblia old testament i guarantee you endo isome one na samani if you na tumia list zote by the way mmoja anaweza list kama unataka uisome mwenyewe uniambie uniambie kama inasema exactly vinasema so kama ati mungu mbele i don't think that's how it works i don't think so sababu kwa new testament ile story ya ee ni inasema hivi God is in you. So that's when the church says again, God is in you. The individual it's a personal relationship. Ni kama ile words are personal relationship. Ni wewe lazima uji activate personally. Ni kama kuna conscious or subconscious mind. Useme I will succeed. Alafu follow your path. Sababu watu wengi waga wanakuwa brainwashed na depend na who ako na interest na life yako. Sawa. So sema na apply green card, alafu Mungu mbele, alafu wati hapo. Alafu useme na relax ah ngoje mungu ni god go go before me what is the matter pastor pastor kwambia let god before go before me alafu mkumbuka pia mo pastor technically he must salesman what chat by the way he must salesman sub chat non profit means kwa mimi nakambia nataka fungua non profit na angalia hizo mashairi okay i'm going to be honest with you guys i'm part of a non profit seriously kabisa i am unless iko iko kama it's dying out ule mtu alikuwa chairman ali move out so but is it requirement that non profit you have to raise funds from the public so kuna design flani sisi wambia specifics but ukiangalia level chat na run is an part of a non profit watu wa dosi don't require chat ndio wapate tax breaks anyway hiyo ni story nyingine so useme at god will go before me preaching yote nakwambia even ile kama unakuwa una motivated ndio tuwe do Anyway, story more. Wacha tu kila mtu conscious yake. Where do do your thing? Do your thing. Turn it back to you. Nimeza kuingia story ile ndapata ma haters hapa hivi na nichukia vibaya. Nasema albua peni Mungu. Ah, mimi mi ni msenaamini Mungu bwana. <laughs> Nasema tu ile logical mind of ujue. Kuna bias in. Unaona? Unajua okay, nilikuwa ndio cheka nani? Nasema stack kuingisha msiko kwa noma noma. Nafanya ndafanya hivi tutakuwa na live tukuwa na conversation ile kama na time job ikipungua kidogo. I love to to discuss hizi vitu ile ikuwe interactive isiko ni one sided itakuwa poa sana hivyo Tony ndio acha Tony Tony si wewe ni 
already applied now leave everything to god mungu mbele sasa naelewa tu ni kwa sababu hiyo nimesema hivyo i don't want it to be a cliche <laughs> so hope to see you bro when i get there no no yeah you need to sababu tu si watu kama mungu god go go before me personally wewe ni yako ni gani that's how you achieve it stack some mtu bible sahihi but nakambia hivyo sawa tuendelee macho za kumunda mambo ya kaka albo nimekutumia picha yangu kwenye whatsapp yako naomba unifanyie review kaka nafanya ndairan kwa hii website ya nini hii website ya ya ama ndangalia metadata nikambi kama iko poor two things ana stangalia mbali alafu ni sio gope nikambia i meet expectations endo ifanye tena kama ni mbaya sasa so ukipata muda nitafurahi kuona input zako kwenye picha yangu nimekutumia kwenye whatsapp sasa ndiangalia leo hopefully hopefully ndiangalia leo msiwache ndiangalia tiktok muangalia mu, mu tiktok ndio isikuwe na isikufe na engagement muona kapoa iko na engagement ama ndai ndai shut down tu niko how long watu si wengi sana huko jui mimi pati less sije karini sije kwa figure kwa computer so nixon ama samani aje albo mbona most men wa kija us huwa huwa who join military na by the way kazi ya military na mse anafanya kazi ya dump truck ni ep ana an pesa mob mimi jui unje military ni iko na salary pia salary ya military iko based on uh, ranking yako kama uko na degree toka Kenya ukiingia military utakuwa officer kuna exam utafanya lakini i'm not the best person kuzee swali kaa nyufa tanga john du- john duty yuko military ama msa yote ashe ingia military before atawaambia hiyo story miss hiyo story poor kabisa ule anaelewa hizo ma structure brother in law wangu alikuwa us army naweza muuliza pia niambie lakini difference ya military ni kama organization fulani hivi kuna salary kuna structure you can save your money sababu ukienda war mostly food is provided accommodation accommodation ni mwanachama la kwa kwa, kwa barracks hiyo si accommodation poor but <laughs> but business ni business business ina, ina potential yako ile nisamaje growth ya business inaweza inaweza grow faster than anything to do with employment lakini military pia unaweza ingia business eventually kama ukiingia na hizo dozo za za arms na hizo makampuni kama Boeing anyway you know still but watu waamua maybe kila mtu maybe ni yule wale wasa kukua your sphere of influence watu wengi wajuangi information unajua hivyo so try we try our best watu kwa youtube kenya so try ku share information na watu ndio watu wako aware but at the end of the day the choice is yours what do you want to do utakuingia military sawa hiyo ndio the best chance kwa nani ingia military umeona sasa kama musa kama john duty aliingia military alikuwa youtube last year ika take time yake off ni notice room sana potea kwa nini sababu kuna vitu labda anakuwa anafanya military haiwezi mwala kukua social media na na kwa military itakuwa itakuwa ita throw balance off kidogo juni hiyo ni organization ni kitu serious sana kwenye military si joke juu mna protect country kuna specific laws na vitu na follow my guidelines so it depends kuna watu wengi military ndio pata ile free education ile GI bill ilikuwa passed juni which second world war ukiingia military au kulipia shule so if that's what you want sawa unaweza ingia hivyo lakini maanisha ni watu wengi it's up to you when una choose si eti ati kuna ati kuna shindana Mini jipa kwa situation I had to go through dump truck ile business. Dump truck ni mekam badai. I bought my first dump truck 2020. Before that nilikuwa side dump. Ilikuwa trucking construction but side dump. Kwa nini? Side dump is cheaper than a dump truck. Some side dump you can take any truck we convert it to a side dump. Dump truck you have to buy the specialized equipment iko exactly kama dump truck. Ada speaking of which labda ndio post ya video moja next week ya dump truck. Moja ilikuwa 2 weeks ago nikienda assist the catch up na hiyo video bado ndio hiyo it depends what we choose hakuna ati nini difference albo steve hapa i've been following you from day one. financial freedom frontier tujaongea tumeongea steve sije ungekuwa getting tasks ngekumbuka poa kabisa kama vini naona let's like the the live guys vini na mjua ju vini you communicate ini poa pia ini poa thanks for sticking around Vini ni aje na najua pia good vision na Joanna. So na Joanna wase. Sawa, ada start staying here to the ina kwaje naona. Anaongea tu conversation yao hapa hivi. Na mimi na wakati hapa kwa screen bana ninge skip yote lakini sawa tu. Acha ni nakia hapa je communication. Hii ni free platform. I've applied and I just hope for the best. 
Hope for the best too. All the best to you. Lakini kata kuingiana, plan B, araka raka. Wesengoze, medyo watu uzeka, you get old every day. Every minute. Niki mazai live from the time uliyadha kuwatch, baka by the time live imeisha, you'll be one hour older. So, <laughs> you're younger an hour ago than you are right now. So, much as a kumunda, took 29 people on the live. Jameni, like the video. Anatupa nuggets, or oh, like video, and some attract some to like video. Like video, like what? Inside the engagement, he caught when you know, inside the engagement, quite algorithm here, YouTube, that's idea. Yaja album, Mamma Vipi, TikTok, anything. TikTok, you know, Mother Sana, by the way, come on, they avoid. I could have swallowed you up. Sa, to the like video, oh, Messa, who could cut her? Niaje ukatar nani alite jina poa poa kabisa niaje sikujui jina personally ukatar uh, labo ni kumuche jina uh, ban texas samaje albo good job bro always in my, my. na shukran shukran bana shukran koko encouragement uh, techno Sean on the beat official chana kijana following eh na jina refu jina yake ni refu kuliko comment <laughs> Jinakini. Lakini mse wangu, kama weni mse msani, uh, kama weni msani, una, una do music, wacha ikuwe plan B, mbaka ikuwe plan A. Kusabu music ni kama side hustle. Usiweke music, unless you do ma concert, una do music ni kitu tricky. Usi, usi, don't waste 10 years ya life yako kuchess music, na ijai succeed. But after job hapa, yani music yoga side hustle. Watu ingu, ma musician, wali yaza side hustle, alafu waka switch. Wakua, yani, Una mtu waza na side hustle, ukikuwa na ile main hustle, side hustle. I love side hustle because it's your passion, uki insist na yo, ina flip, ina kuwa the main hustle, I love una takufanya ile main hustle, I love ina kuwa the whole thing. Naona sasa, music ni very tricky by the way. Success rate ya music ni kama 1% out of 99. 99 kuna failure rate. So, kuwa very careful na hizi to is art. Nazamu kuwa na team around wewe. Kama ukuji focus na the right team, utakuwa saa. So, kuna watu wa like video. Asama hivo. Before ninge kwa hiyo nini. So how is racism in the West, especially certain countries? And have you ever faced such? Leno na shindua kama. Hiyo ni kawaida. Racism. Asa kambi kitumoja na racism. Kisika ya tumio wadi kwa. Tisame tumio utumwa. Utumwa ni hivi. Hiyo jina. Tiju jina gani. Tisame stock exchange. So so. Yendi jina yeti ya leo. <laughs> mzungu yoyote mzungu. Wazungu wali from 18, tuju ni 18 something, 1835 or something. Wazungu wote wali kufundishwa kukuwa na ubaguzi. Wali fundishwa. Yani ni kama upata mzungu yote default. Default ni mbaguzi. Default. Hata before, hata wanafundi. Yani kama kukua, ni, hii utumu iko hivi. Iko systematic. Mwana systematic ni nini? Ni system. Systematic. Mwana. Ile, iko, in, ito kama implicit bias kuna ile explicit bias anakambia on your face but watu wengi wako implicit bias ile tukua ndani yao kwa rona juwa na chukia tu watu juwa meambiwa sisi ni watu wachafu sisi ni watu ni my allegations tu ni ile kama unatumia mtu akufanyie kazi for free uweza taka ajue uweza taka akwena any sympathizers jina ni empathizers si sympathy sympathy ni different empathizers they are kwangi empathetic towards watu waliko watumwa. Awa wana nikama, they would rather wasikia ile uongo wali danganywa, ati wa Afrika ni wachafu, ni akili ndogo, ni wajinga, wanawake wao ni promiscuous. Any, they want to believe that sabu, ni tunga cognitive dissonance. You know, kilo nafanya ni si utu, si ubinadamu, lakini you want to make yourself feel good about your bad deeds. So what do you do? Una, una try ku? Because it's your position. Anyway, ndio hiyo sasa. Ina exist. Hiyo sijali ni kama institutionalize iko iko other tax of history. Now get fanya hivi. In the future tukimaliza story ya DV, tutakamp tuko na discussion to bring topic flani. Alafu tuende step by step ndio staki kwa opinion yangu peke yangu. Nataka mtu at least to contribute to engage your utumwa itakuwa poa kwa mtu wa kama join conversation alafu tuonge in general. Minda moderate kitu kama hiyo. Alafu ndo tu ile itakuwa different perspective juu. Hapa ndakuwa one-sided. Stack wangi yesu tuli sana sayi. Itakuwa one-sided. So, Derek asamaje, uh, present, okay, present, saa. Itakuwa hivo. Uh, Haron Jangi, Jandi. 
Yes, my Jangi. Sir, none of you miss Imani as a manager. Good to see you, bro. After BSN, you go for the doctorate. Nurse practitioner. Oh, and Mr. Are you a nurse practitioner? Just a quick one. Can I visit Kenya as a new immigrant with my green card? Yeah, exactly. When a green card, that's your thing. Sabre Jonini. Come on, Mimi. When I when I travel to Kenya, for example, bro, do you travel? Suppose you travel to Kenya. Passport yangu Kenya may expire. So I have to get that renewed. Like if you can passport here, America is valid. So when I travel to Kenya, for example, ndatokapa kama mtu wa Marekani, na vuka airport, na passport yangu ya American. In Kenya, I have to pay for tax. I mean, I'm an immigrant. I don't anymore. But if I show up with my Kenyan passport, Kenya, then I'm free. So you can't even put it in the dual citizenship. You have to exit the American passport, and you enter the Kenyan passport. You have to do your work, and you exit the Kenyan passport, and you enter the American passport. So you can't even possible. You can't even do it. It's possible. But the green card is when you have your Kenyan passport. That means you're not an American citizen. Okay, exit America, una exit na your Kenyan passport, na green card. You don't need, you don't need the green card when you're exiting. But when you're coming back to America, that's more show green card you only. Oh, when you, when you permanent residence, that's what you do. Come my mom, I got to me a green card. So the only time you need the green card specifically, by the way, when when you're traveling out of the country. So abu okay, you back without the green card, they will never let you in. Uta ingia kwa any port of entry. Or I go back to where you, from where you came from. So green card, you come a visa, permanent. You show I'm actually a permanent residence. You can accept it back into your country of residence. So you can travel anytime as long as you have it. That makes sense. So next, Nigani. Uh, Carlton, come a Kawaida. So I'm a big up, Mze, Mzito. Albo, Albe. Nivoels, by the way. Alba, Albe, Albi, Albo. Albu, Nivoels. <laughs> so, Akondakas, Akondaine, Akondani, Mesaugani, Gine. Kama Kawaida Carlton. Nivoels, Hile. So, Maish Kenya, so, which are the best dates for application? And I will use Owen. You need Owen. No, no. Paid. Paid uh, paid information. And I can Owen, I can be. Mr. Dewey, which are the best dates to apply application? Yana Juwa, I should study the video. Aliangalia, Nijo Owen, ni CPA, ni accountant. So I was looking at trend, this trend here the last, I was looking at analysis here the last, you know, 10 years. I was looking at this, I was looking at this, I was looking at this. So I was statistics, I was looking at this time, more people get visas, less people get visas. So I was a Kenyan American home, I think in TikTok. I was looking at information, I was looking at this. When I was looking at information, I was looking at this, because it's a paid the subscription. For his time, I was looking at this time. I don't know. Oh, you could be the son of it. So, Mr. Gopi could leave. I'm leaving you. Do I keep here? I feel like my information about you is missing. I'll make you analysis. I can't. 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 Month flani. More people get visas. Let's forget visas. So, I know you. You need to read. Okay. Yeah, that's you. Can you give up? I don't want to leave. I'm unfortunately. No, no. Passport photo is three hundred Kenyan shillings. Okay, sir. We need to send my passport photo is three hundred Kenyan shillings. Sir, I need to leave three hundred Kenyan shillings. It's worth it. No, do I. As a business owner, mu take risk. So, na your risk kuna two options. Niki fail, eh, ni fail, sour, terrible. But niki succeed, so mu gani ko more optimistic. Mu sema chances of the reason why I'm taking the risk ni ile, in case niki succeed, it may supersede niki fail, sour. So sema I'm buying a truck. You buy truck. The truck I was driving ni kuwa paid off. 2020 ni kuwa na Freightliner, Columbia. 2007, nika by 2021, Quint Axel dump truck. Ilikuwa 224,000. Yuni pesa nilipa, by the way. Nifanyo wa diska, ilikuwa 240 kapo, diska na julika mekapa kwa dealership for a long time. Ilikuwa ili stock haija move. Because they were getting a new, nini, wakani fanyi a discount, they wanted it gone. Of course, gari zonga overpriced anyway, by the way. Gari zonga overpriced. Everything in America is overpriced. Uda pala labda kosi, yu gari ni 140. But because in the business they have to sell, you and you you mark up and your profit here. So only if any discount here to twenty, because I believe the last, the last year twenty twenty one, the last ille jongaze stock, because okona stock mupi na kam twenty twenty two. So because this was the last truck, they already made their money. Okana if any discount here two hundred and twenty thousand. Otherwise, everybody else only pay two hundred and forty thousand. So so musa musa matu kuele yangu likuwa two twenty. I mean, why lie? Lakini 
hiyo risk ya kubaiyo truck in the beginning it, it didn't make me any money the first year okay it is okay maybe ngiri moja ngiri mbili once in a while but i knew i'm building towards something so hii risk ilikuwa worth it so hii sasa ikiangalia kama 4 years down the lane karibu ni pay off by the way 2020 2024 20, almost paid off by the way maybe 2 months 3 months back I left by April next year I can pay off anyway that being said that being said <laughs> so funny anyway you you got it size cuz any passive income one of us it any the money from that truck in a contribute towards it it in a make my life easier in a sense if you get what i'm saying i'm still driving an old truck myself in 2019 like it evolve on 2021 still making me money one of us passively i don't have to drive it somebody drives makes me money so ile ile risk unachukua kama ni 300 dollars kufanya passport hiyo 300 dollars could be a lot of money now but 3 years from now it could be peanuts so is it worth the risk the benefits outweigh the risk that's what i'm saying hivyo so lipa hiyo 300 apiga pizza no no positivity hapa kuna negativity uh, ina ku show pia kama iko na era era ni ile i na go through rakaraka before to my life rakaraka na go through the whole thing so this month you have to i have maybe two more lives that repeat this story after this maybe to move kwa kama salusha win na create a video kama ya ku fill up ds ni ds 150 ama 250 hizo ma ds hizo ma documents afterwards because i did them niko nazo by the copies zangu zote niko nazo bado niangalia file katika files zote kabisa ana namba yangu ya dv ilikuwa dv 2000 and seven yangu ilikuwa 2007 ndio dv yangu niko naye si hizi washoji kuna jina yangu na nini ma personal lakini anyway naweza show mkitaka ni kididactic au mawazles fa kwa kwa so aita show picha na photo of the fakua you mean i prefer enda kwa studio who know what they are doing hata kama unashuku enda kwa pigo picha alafu nitumie alafu ndakaangalia hiyo metadata nikwambie oh iko poa kabisa kuna requirements fanya hivi nitumie email uh, blip Uh, bop sije blip bop <laughs> tuba tuba nini i'll send you the information ama sije ni copy up abu naweza fanyaje pdf pdf kwa youtube ni share ndio kwa kwa ama ni yake hata sije ni fanya miss na website ndio gapi naweza print your information ndio kwa comment hii video kwa hii video comment hizo ma requirements uziangalie uzisome ni very simple ni very simple ile tumo kuna specification za picha zile metadata inafakuwa 600 megapixels by 600 megapixels on allow and like a professional it's worth it pay somebody to do the job you don't want to do mona sasa na kwa hivyo so vini uh, it had an error yesterday but now it's okay oh so sa ilikuwa passport still ilikuwa gani oh hiyo machine yenyewe the the the, the website was on apply by the way it's busy so you got to be very careful to apply apply my payment you sing the last day sab kila mtu ngoja paka last minute don't do that kwa the first one kwa kila kitu mpenda ngai mpenda kwa the first one kwa everything ndio ile kama say voting voting you were supposed to vote november 4th so please don't apply on november 4th utakuwa too late sabu america wale wana run your website utakuwa kienda ku vote so hata na ile sema hivyo oh and asema please to make it to before november by end of this month we two months and I'm end kabisa kwa sababu tuko na election this year november 4th ni election november 3rd itakuwa very busy november 5th ni results the president has announced so please come and apply green card apply my payment this month next month that will apply don't even do it next month too late malzana na this month kama una hii live leo malzana na history leo and even malzana kila kitu that I can make videos less na 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 go through everything this week at a tiktok peer and your tiktok mo ta say nini mbali sana hebu nione kama kuna any swali hapa hivi hakuna ingine nuggets of wisdom i'm selling uh, tiktok zimeisha hakuna sana so watu tu wengi sana anyway so 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 uh, i'm still listening good visuals dante prince vp albo see one man cave you bring guests eg nurses military people etc watu wange watu wate elimisha But Dante Prince by the way it's stuck bring was say we invite watu kuja hapa hivi unapigia mtu sato ako busy unampigia sunday anapata excuse so i gave up and didn't give up so labda ni nitoke nje niende lakini kumbuka the reason why niko so busy this season ju na run track tatu peke yangu last year ilikuwa na wife 
kama sasa yani watu they don't have time kama nas nas haizi kuja kwa live labda ni mtafute job sababu wako job na kama kwa home amelala labda kuna familia it depends no no ila maybe ni kwa tu ile kama ni kuna short interview jum hii kitu ko structured mood do live every sunday lazima mtu akuwa available available on sunday one day nako nako lucky unless ni fanya live stream mtu wa join live stream itakuwa poor but size na time nafa ku fix track yangu antenna ya ile cb radio before tomorrow so after live hivi dakimbe ni supplies za wiki kuna supplies move by is my window washer fluid my oil my grease is already by is what okay but kuna kama shelf hivi mwi ya flow zingine alafu ni make track ku ready alafu ni come home ni prepare for the week nianza wiki tena muone sasa so sina time mob sana so in the future ikuwa winter kifika na kuwa na live maybe 3 4 5 6 hours alafu maybe mtu akuje kama guest aonge itakuwa poor i don't mind mimi na moderate tu muone so auto patikani sio tena tunasema kama unajua nas yote au kana do youtube cg ana skills yote ni video sana mwambie tu endo mwanzo maswali mimi si compete na mtu by the way kaka kuna mtu information more power to you pariana information but watu wako busy pia sasa sio tena nimekataa ile tu watu wapatikani you relocated in the US in 2007 what are you doing what were you doing before you got into tracking around 2012 What were you doing before you got into tracking around 2012? Feel 2012 when you got got truck mbaya sana. I was still driving truck. Hapo na maisha nini 2002. Sababu 2007 to 2012 in some years. Company yangu officially nimekuwa established 2012. Hapo ndo nime nime buy truck nikaendesha truck peke yangu. 2011 nilikuwa dere, 2010 nilikuwa dere. Mwana 29 2009 nilikuwa dere, 2008 August September ndo nimeanza tracking ni kwa year and some months old in america so as you know the new feel 2012 ni kuanzia the company already I was still doing tracking actually 2012 ndio officially my company ni established ile with my i bought my truck my first truck ile kwa hiyo mwezi 2012 april march ama may kitu kama hiyo sikumbuki your date i think in april something like that 2012 11 ni kuna drive hiyo mse so was the album zidi kutuchanua you should run for you should run for our subconscious mind else someone will ru- oh, you should ru- run our oh, no 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 i can't run your subconscious mind anyway someone else will ruin it for us <laughs> i can't do that you need too much responsibility you, know, you, you have the power in you by the way that's the whole concept come 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 on a story ji stuck some bible books abu kuna vile social media penangi story kama hizo ile ukilin towards your strong opinion apenangi story kama hizo lakini kwa ikikuwa tupi word moja tu word moja wale watu usoma new testament kuna mali au mwitanga jesus lakini jina yake si jesus ni yeshua yeshua ndio jina yake real jesus ni jina inatoka kwa european hizo ma translation za europe jesus hiyo si jina ya jesus hata j exists kwa hebrew ni yeshua kama joshua yeshua so yeshua kwa sababu hivi teaching kwa sababu hivi asemaje the kingdom of heaven is within you sky story The kingdom of heaven is within you. Endo some teachings za Yeshua tena. Uone kile nasema. Asemi ati the kingdom, kingdom of heaven is with Albo to control my uh, 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 it's within you. You have the power to determine your destiny. In other words, it's in the tukumbuka Yeshua was killed by the government. Kama your story is real. I mean, kuna kuna my whole holes. Alikuwa killed by the government of the day. So like what anti establishment. Akwa sama you don't need to go to a fancy church. The kingdom of heaven dwells in you. The spirit dwells in you. Skia story. Kama kama unasoma ng Bible, si lazima usome by the way. Lakini I think it's very universal. Sababu hiyo jina ya the kingdom is within you. Ukiangalia Buddhist, uangalie Hindu, uangalie hizo ma religion ma Zoric, zina ongea juu ya story ya within you. History ya Gavile kam kuingilia ikaita Christianity ndio ilikam kwa ribu maneno inasema kam kwa church nipeni sadaka fuata mtu mmoja let them teach you you don't know anything you're peasant I'm okay whatever even as I'm you have it in you you're subconscious kama una information maybe you need to read more kwa nini when you read more ama kama uwezi soma by the way find podcast utaongea suppose sema i want to learn more about business enda kwa youtube sitasema tiktok YouTube YouTube ni boring by the way nimesema ni repeat pake imekuwa 
nikona nisema jina yake wrong last time jina yake inaitwa Scott 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 Galloway Scott Galloway sijabai book yake bado naiba kwa list yangu do alisema the boring things will make you rich the boring things will make you wise no no the boring things see entertainment studies intimate the boring things will make you rich end of the podcast here how to start a business come on you shares how does shares work skiza the first time unaskiza it makes sense in video ya mtu anaongea haraka haraka kama mimi there's a mu record video do i watch my videos and ah i could have said that better but then would you review kama you would na watch video kama next week na you watch kama 3 4 times okay na views angles kuna i got four views you ni mimi <laughs> you may watch four times to make sure kila nimeongea it makes sense so that's how i i build mu make video na make live after two three hours i i watch it again and again and again that's how i nataka ku improve video yangu that's why from the beginning kianza hii video paka sasa hii nimekuwa na some form of confidence because you are same many in high many enlightened like I, i'm learning how to speak to you better by doing videos every day so ana kama hiyo change hiyo nekani i know it's this different sababu sasa hii mwanga very careful how i communicate na try ku filter na kuna fikiri about community guidelines alafu how do i communicate effectively ndio ni make message so kidembia nimesema hivi specifically nimesema mimi christians i'm not opinionated na try kwa even ground ile even nasema bible says the kingdom of heaven is within you so anybody akona hiyo capacity ya kukuwa the greatest you've ever been in life kafta mtu celebrity ashindwa what are you talking about kama una mwanangani celebrity ni mtu kawaida tu by the way ni mtu kawaida tu the ordinary you can do great things no no i will send you a helper the helper you will do greater things than this skia your topic by the way I, i don't know how i can explain that that's what some people here it's like what come kwa ile interaction with the story sababu wewe mwenyewe kuna hiyo capacity you have the capacity mona wewe si eti ni mimi nakusaidia ikila nakwambia ile maybe you didn't know learn study utakuwa hivyo yani you, you'll have the abilities to decipher vitu mzuri good from evil naona poverty from rich uko na hii hii ni unadanganywa hapa hii hii ni brainwash na hii brainwash you will know that kwa nini ili toka discernment you'll have the discernment bona albona do business from sana that oh albert what do you think of tracking kama kweli kabisa for the sake of life lazima ni interact na wasaid you kila mtu kwa level nyingine kuliza what do you think about tracking kuliza mtu kama what do you think about tracking in 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 retrospect ile tu in real it's a stupid question but ask the stupid question kwa nini sababu kama ukiwa kama unless mo chele yangu video moja in the first time you watch my videos kama ushe watch video yangu previously utajua tracking ina ni benefit mimi na everything move for tracking labda kama nime miss something nime mwaga yote from last year kwa hizo video nime poor tu yani kila mtu achukue it's up to you free for the takers no no the free free information utajua tracking ni lipia bill by the way driving tracking ni lipia bill ina buy hizo microphone hizo microphone hizo masimu simu nne angalia mwaga na simu ngapi mwe mlisema ile na simu mbili i hate this by the way i hate having two phones i hate it i prefer yangu personal phone personal phone alafu na phone ya tatu iko hapa ya nini i hate having three four phones na chukio but because i'm doing business na choice it's not choice as i'm separate how did i learn kwa kitu asemaje put your business away from your personal life muona sasa kuwa na vitu yani umezitenga hii ni biashara hii ni personal but i enjoy doing it too kuna ile pleasure sababu when you try something for the first time alafu na work out you feel good about yourself kwa nini you are achieving something ile kujua kama uko nayo ina unlock another potential another level of your 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 consciousness so kumbuka the kingdom of heaven is within you kama the words na make sense kwako kama as you make sense kwa mambo ya kingdom sema you have the ability you to be the best you can be where where nobody else just you where where you just you just need more information you need more knowledge you need more that's what you need the ile ile the things you the things that are difficult for you to, to do right now is because you don't know them but once you mezijua uko na 100 by the way to be honest maybe you could even uko na more capacity than mimi kuzifanya you will do greater things than mimi utakamu do live yako utakuwa na kizungu na kiswahili uta have more reach utakuwa na more 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 everything kwa nini because umeona hii yangu ndogo hii inafanywa kwa basement man cave talk 
ita do greater things than me kwa nini sababu wewe unaanza au wanzima mimi nianzia trying to figure it out wewe already kuna shoulder to stand off labo muona Kenyan American home Owen umeona maybe John Duty umeona na sababu tumajina leo tunajua umeona tu wasio they have done it before you did so all you have to do ni kuangalia game plan yao then you perfect it unaona sasa that's why ni muhimu kufanya hizi ma live alafu mfanye hizi live ni ile hata watu wengi kama kuniangalia in case nikikufa leo the only memory they have ni ku watch videos of me oh this is my dad i have done live two years ago ndio ni yake na muona ndio huyu hapa kama is like speaking to me ile memory yangu i'm i'm creating a digital footprint ya watoto wangu pia muona sasa so you have the capacity don't even doubt yourself don't self sabotage your progress usifikirie doubt nobody achieves anything suppose kama ule mtu Steve Jobs kama example in example ni musa mani cliche i don't believe jina yake ndio inapia there's somebody ule jina yake unknown ali create iphone but kama Steve Jobs akisema man this thing ya is this project ya iphone i don't think you can make it i don't think so he to give up alafa give up self sabotage atungwa iko na f iphone sai but guess what he did it anyway said na iphone 16 mimi na 15 zangu zimekuwa mzee i don't get the same by the way iphone don't get the same as they change the last g how is it more than which at least i make any difference sababu you don't even use the features anyway nilo too they have to pitch a new idea every year to boost the sales ni sales by the way uh, business ni is not purpose of business is not to make money is to create customers long life customers so iphone is oh it's this year everybody is doing that by the way come on for the model ya iphone so iphone is one of the richest company in the world sai i think it makes sense it doesn't make any sense that you're the richest i think the most famous phone ni android na samsung lakini iphone beats them kwa nini ina uza kitu premium it more money just like ironically tesla iko na shares zake ni more expensive than ford ama bmw ama toyota kwa nini because tesla is an electric company na ukiangalia toyota have more sales have more outreach lakini tesla ime position in a way it's it's defining automotive industry na electricity so you aspect ile ya ku define ile it's so far off removed from the regular ones shares that tesla is a quality 80 dollars shares alafu ford ni 16 dollars angalia difference so kinua shares kwa stock exchange tesla is a more expensive so it'll make you more money the people who are making money wale wale no mapema una new difference kwa nini is innovative ni a software company that is ours goes electric any it's different from the norm imagine tuna ni idea tu So where is self sabotage la go anywhere sometimes you have to take those hard decisions those hard risks it make a difference me every time i buy truck ndio ndio go pa we show kasema wait a minute e decision ni make buy truck iko na payment sababu comfort zone ni comfort zone una una unabaki hapo kwa status quo kama uko broke uko complain i'm broke every day you will keep the all you're doing is whining out i advance lazima u take risk useme acha njitoe Kenya ni Dubai for example Middle East alafu while you're there uko uncomfortable you uncomfortability it create an animal that's my common example ile lion itafunka yani uta arouse the, the, the lion the passion ile inside you ikisema this is not my life let me make it better kama usama ngaivo usama kama joke tukasema tu ndanua gari na taka one day kama say it's very weird gari na 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 truck by gari sai na 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 van by the way van si si gari ati ati range rover i need a van ile kuna viti mbili na space ya cargo that's it ni kama hii box truck why do i need a van sababu kile na supply za truck zangu muone na gari mbili na na drive moja trip moja na na kama df na nuwa kama 22 df za wiki naona three per truck na na trip moja kama sasa need to go repair my truck na need ngazi na need tools sasa bili ni gari moja ni drive kachukua supply ni rudi hivi alafu chukua gari nyingine nene ni repair alafu ni rudi alafu tena ni drive gari moja nene ni drop supply alafu ni rudi hizo ni two trips so i just need a van ile kuna space ni kama shelf so nikienda ku buy supplies one trip tools zangu ziko hapa imagine mimi sasa i just need a van utility van i'm shopping for a van sababu somebody wants to buy my a6 akinunua tu hivi hiyo pesa ningekovaa umeona sasa perspective ime change what about the q7 ana jeu za wali dai by this car now ona i decide ni comfortable lakini like, 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 i'm looking for a van mtashangaa mkena video my brand new 2024 van mtashangaa na buy van by the way 
ana pick up traffic vani kuna space hivi nafungua mlango ndani hiyo ndio my next car so i'm looking for the best van so i need to a ford transit uh eco boost 3.5 alafu kuna trail trail ni off road sasa kile elf road na ni watu ile maybe 250 ama 350 hizo ndio poor nishaenda shopping by the way nilikuwa shopping on friday jioni kuangalia moja i could impress sana but i'm looking for a van imagine so angalia priorities me change kwa nini my goal ni five trucks if i have three trucks and i'm struggling nisha ku prepare mapema let me get a van before ni kuna five trucks <laughs> so like you seven itauzo itauzo immediately ngoja tu one somebody like show up and party deal game over imeenda ngona sasa somebody like by gari moja ndogo tuna tuta corolla tena so hii hata si big deal the priorities na change over time okay anyway tuendelee so i'm free otiana as imagine number yako tunapataje kuna story nataka kukuchapia inbox na mangi kwa every video youtube oh excuse me paying attention humphrey where is mgeni where is mgeni humphrey wish i could before na mangi kwa available kwa description ya video every video fungua video saa hii ya ni post jana wana kwa description section utaona contact information kuna email namba ya simu na nini nyingine kwa tiktok kuna inbox pia ni instagram kila kitu kwa hapo namba iko available lakini ni text kwanza Hope na namba yako sababu kama ukini text na namba yako na sikujui I don't know how to reply to you. Nitumie jina lako ji introduce kwanza. Ile tu heshima sema hey my name ni Amfri, niko kwa live jana na hii swali alafu ni save namba yako. Mu save namba za kila mtu. Simu si zinaonyesha kwa hapa hiyo kwa TikTok already. Mada nione kama naweza asiezi angalia sana iko hapa kwa TikTok namba. But ndio hivyo. Namba iko available. Kama wewe si mgeni labda uone ngi video sana. Muongee serial namba kila siku. So Captain Tony asemaje the specific day issue is a big lie about nini ni statistics too such that when many people apply in a given day it's bound to have many people selected dv is pure luck captain tony i may give opinion yake i say the specific day thing is statistics captain i cannot do not una track jibu swali gani exactly ilikuwa ya aka donge zuya which day is the best to apply for ilikuwa green card ama ilikuwa story ya visa kwa sababu kama ni visa Kenya na American home kama ni green card this year kama una states captain tony this year advisable up to my application before november kwa sababu kumbuka campaign inaendelea sasa hii presidential election so november 4th ni voting day november 5th wana announce November 3 itakuwa cares. Hizi ma hizi ma software za DV zina run wana kuna watu wana wanazirun background. People are to fanya nini? Au fanya programming. Sawa, so, programming. Wana make sure system is up in place. I I'm pretty sure what a slow down between November 3rd, 4th na 5th. So you don't want to be sending your application your green card the last three days. Sababu so, watu wengi wao waga hivyo. Human behavior watu ngojia paka last minute alafu wana rush in mara moja ile bottleneck bottleneck so people will be sending so many application hata kama hii software ni advance hata wakati stretch out at some point they will cut it off itapatikana wewe mwenyewe umetupoa nje na because uli apply late ile sababu computer programming technically computer ni binary hizo inge hivi one by one at some point bottleneck ile bottleneck na mwaga maji na kwa kidini kama funnel hivi funnel funnel na kai hivi alafu na narrow down inaingisha ndani kwa application so to be advisable maliza hii story recommended before end of this month itakuwa poor hivyo sana before the end of this month umetuma application itakuwa poor then be on the safe side musa ma mu era towards kama kuna time in event in under 7 o'clock i will show up at 6:45 unless nimechelewa watoto ama si ile event ya time kama ni birthday ile za chelewa juu sometimes with chelewa purpose ni sababu ni birthday stuck in my crowds i have three kids i want to show up when they are carrying the cake alafu ni chomoke je niko peke yangu bibi na watoto watatu say you manage so na show up late alafu nitoke earlier tu nipote ile just to show up but kama ni place kama ni place schedule i always show up earlier mbona sasa alafu ndaka mpaka late that's what i mean by that lakini specific day pure luck it's your opinion and all the swallies you know jibu swali gani but preferably kama ni dv apply alia kama ni story ya application ya hizo ma b1 ile ya kenya american hiyo misema hivi kwa ni yake sema there some months in a year 
more people get visas, less people get visas. Even it's true, by the way. It's very true. And the one video, like Kenyan American home, Owen. I love a subscription. So, that's my subscription. You, you work hard, Sana. Show how many lives in Kenyan American home find. You find a live come every day, Sazingile. He takes his time. Na pia na wate wane kama yu, by the way. Namju, I see it. So, like some subscription, I'm saying, you in a motivate for them more. Alichukwa hile analysis akaona the last 10 years. Statistics is not matter, by the way, despite what Republicans say. There's not just a Republican, like, you know, mambo ya nini, mambo ya politics. Kumbo uliaza traki mapema. Mbona basi uliingia deni mingi venye ulisema ama uli uliamua kurudi college. Fils, jini kwambia api? Deni, ni mingi huku 2007. 2008 ni chukuma credit card. Ya nini? Just regular stuff. I was trying to build my credit. Nika nuwagari. Ilikuwa payment. Ilikuwa deni. Ini, itongaje. Uh, deni gari itongaje. Mesa yu jina. Kuna deni ya gari. Uh, jina kata kuingia sa hii. Nilichukua gari ya deni. Nipa kulipa na four years. Ilipata accident by the way. Ilikuwa total. 2009. Nikapua pesa. I got. Ilikuwa compensated. Nikapua gari. Kai pay off. Nika nuwengine kubwa. Because I had a child. Sa hii. Nikuwa na mtuo hii. 2009 hivi. Nikuwa na mtuo hii. 2010. And what Camry. Camry was kuwa yuza. I gave it to my mom, by the way. You Camry. You can know Audi. You can know Audi. So you, I had debt, you credit card debt. Even you I wanted clothes. I wanted furniture. I wanted a bed. So as lived za za my tajiza kawaida, I was borrowing. You can in debt. You can have apartment. I own a kitanda. I own a couch. I own a meza. I own a dishes. You can have a debt. You can have a debt. You can have a debt. You'll pay them over time. Kama hii couch, hii couch sidi ni by cash. Siku hizi. Siku hizi I have enough money. If I need a couch, na inuwa cash. But back in the days, ni kwa fanyakazi minimum wage. Ni kwa na mwadeni kusabu, I had to buy things on debt, ni ni kuwe nazo. Kusabu ni kwa, I was starting over. In the beginning. Ata ya probably ringe, utachukua deni. Kusabu, wezi ya phone, kama watu simu, nana simu, simu kama hii. iPhone. Utaka iPhone, watu lipia for two years, iPhone. Two years. Ile unachukua ni 1,300. Una lipa 5,000 down, alafu una lipa only divide into 24 months. After two years, ni una kuwa yako. So, wame lock, kuna ime lockiwa. So, uki, uki omua kutuwa kwa network yake hivi, you have to pay the whole amount, ni contract. Uspopeo, utaribu credit yako. So, you need to have credit to qualify kwa na iPhone 15. Ya deni. Lakini mimi ni bizna. Mwich kwa simu, na lipa cash na walk away. No, no, ini different. So, deni likuwa ile kutra kwa establish life yangu, kunuwa gari, kunuwa manguo, kunuwa viatu, kunuwa couch, kunuwa TV. Nchukuna deni. Then I had to pay it off. Hizo ndi deni zangu za kwanza. So, by the time in 2015, I paid off all my debt. Nikuwa ile ya couch, ya manguo, ya credit card, everything was paid off. So, from 2015, yu nimekuwa debt free. Paka leo. So, nijua, I, I, I learned how to manage my money better. Ndiyo yu story ya deni. Siti kwa na jonga yu story, Phil, ama, ama ujui poa, ndiyo yu story yangu basi. TikTok on anything, I'm on his email TikTok. Learn more about elections. <laughs> anyway, it in the lay. Hope sound like a poor. You make up on terrible. So Edmund Chege, if you're moving from Minneapolis, which state would you move in? What makes Minnesota better than any other state? Edmund Chege, ni kuzoya tu, kuzoya. Minnesota, mini mezoya. Ni mezoya tu, kakawa zungu. Nijo Minnesota, iku 80% white. Any state, iku south. Kama... Alabama, Louisiana, Texas, Missouri, Georgia, North, Dakota, North, North Carolina, South Carolina, Maryland. Kuna wausi wengi sabu wale wausi ni wale, wale ma, uh, ma relatives or ma slaves. Slaves wengi kwa southern states. Southern states are warmer than northern states. Lakini all the states were racist. Yosi story. So mimi ni kihama, maybe I'll have a house, maybe, in a warmer state. Ile in December, if I need a break, then the South, Texas, if maybe San Antonio. <laughs> so, I have a life here. I have a Midwest. 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 So, I don't think there's a move any state. I'm so grounded in Minnesota. So I will buy a house in San Antonio, Texas. Because San Antonio is where I'm in Nairobi. And it's cheaper than San Antonio. California is very expensive. Florida is too expensive. So maybe San Antonio. Alafu na, na kimbia uko summer, alafu na rudi. I mean winter, winter. Alafu na rudi. Ama ata Laredo kwa boda. 
kwa boda kabisa juu kwa ni kuwarm sana lakini mimi nasema ni ile tu system zangu zime zimekoma hapa hivi my parents wako hapa my brother sisters family business kila kitu kwa touch tu hapa watu wao my friends everything life yangu ni revolve around hapa mimi nasema but hii ni mimi unaona i can move to any other state i don't think so ya pita kwa home bado so nick m alafu albo unaweza cut off broker kwa construction job ama italeta shida ni ngumu sana ni ngumu sana una cut off how do you cut off your broker bona ni, ni, kama ukifungua your own brand new customer unaweza compete na apple kweli hawezi the best thing ni ku partner na apple alafu build shares zako if you'll ever make it sababu apple pia tayari oh, wale wanangoje catch up nao ni competition they will beat you every single time so cut off broker construction ile you can get some few jobs on the side less and less more but eventually lazima uta split here utafanya your private jobs 40% alafu 60% na broker kwa nini sa broker ndio kuna largest market share so chances are uki try to cut off you will lose sababu utakuwa enemy wake atakuwa void alafu ata shut down your business you don't play in a business na ina more leverage kuliko una unanyemelea kando kando yani kama kwa cut off broker musa maivi the jobs they don't want to do are the ones i'll do sa mara mingi unapata the big companies they have small jobs they send them to brokers on azilenga kwa nini it's a waste of their time unataka shanga sana kampuni mfanya kazi nayo broker wangu hiyo sema hivi any job equal less than 100 million awachukui skill story there's some 100 million come with a skill story anything less than 100 million hata they don't even mess around with you no no so which means 98 million they will walk away from it mimi 98 wewe acha tu hiyo ni domo sana <laughs> so broker broker lembo fanya kazi nao ako na 16 trucks zake alafu alafu ana control karibu truck 150 so imagine so ako na arsenal ya 200 trucks na hizo ni trucks tu ako na pit zake pit mali anauza mchanga so uwezi compete naye ameanza hii kampuni 1984 so ako na head starting ni mbaya sana these are big companies when they need the tracking needs guess who they call first yeah yeah so lazima wewe mwenyewe upenye pole pole labo wanza zile uchukue ma, ma breadcrumbs zile the jobs less than 100 million ama 50 million uchukue hizo sasa sababu kwa ye is mo, not so much money kwa wewe ni big deal mbona sasa but you can't just cut them off lazima work hand in hand paka any you succeed in your own way labo umaja na au mpato asemeaje give me all your small jobs i'll do them una negotiate that's what you do sababu either way you make money either way lakini si rahisi hivyo lazima we establish market ni yako presence understood indeed experience is the best teacher saa hii wewe ni gwinji wa personal finance si gwinji ni nini basi amongea shay moja noma ni ni my personal experience mtu akifunisha say personal finance do at a miss in my mind it's like i don't even get it that well but when i apply these things they they work out so musa man and you say personal finance ni ile My, the way that you may, may learn from experience you from milango it's working so to ni daily na work in a, i'll tell you the same thing live within your means si manishi ati kama kama mimi for example nasema hivi budget yangu ya month ni 5000 sometimes mu exceed 6000 7000 but mu jua budget yangu ni 5000 so when it equal 6000 i'm concerned why is it 6000 and i can investigate wapi ndo na lose money Mbona sasa? A uh, business our zangu kwa mwaka ni 1800 to 2000. Najua hivyo already. Payment ni 120. Kuna 125 ile truck nyingine. Kuna 135 kama nitrela yangu. So unapiga hesabu yako, unasema you can have less, you can have more. So if you work less, that means kama excuse me one choka vibaya. Kwa nini? Nimelala Friday jioni. Nimemka saa 3 tuwe tu saa 2 activity. Kidogo kidogo tu siku siku dua very commitment sana saa 2. Nikalala tena afternoon up. Nimelala leo nime sleep in kidogo mpaka 9 sasa ndio sikia poa kidogo sababu mume msemaje nataka nikuwe at least nikuwe na ile nikuwe niko active during live juu ni information important kwa watu wengine so mume lala looking forward to the live alafu after this narudi back to the job niende nifanye repair truck nichukue supplies nipe kit trip tatu bla 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 watoto shule kesho okay what's it cares so that's it come to here kwa nitafuta dada da anipati ana shule nimeenda wapi tulikuwa na yeye so ni kawaida so unajipatia goal it seemed to work for me so i said if only i had more time if only so you need your time yangu i'm trying to buy back my time 
That's not about like a new Q7. You get a brand new. I'm I'm buying a van. A new van, by the way. I'm not kidding. A new van. You know, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> you cannot kill me as driver, passenger. I love to cargo with you. I love to take my shelves and take my tools. Like it's like a moving shop. You know, your concept when you talk about service van, you know, it's like when I get tumble. So it's my van. I'll build it myself. Like when I put the truck up, so like when I'm going to my truck, I have everything I need for your van. I don't need to make too many trips. It's like what easier can go by the way. So na na noktile ile ile tani fitin. It's like white in color, kama kwa ida. But in the van, in the utility vehicle, she pick up truck in the van. You just fungi everything down here. Lafu zikwa secure up here. Anyway, that's why. Tundele, don't move from Minnesota. Oh, Virox and Azu ali move Canada. Oh, poor you, Virox. Poor. I feel sorry for you. <laughs> World Cup 2026. Will Canada and the US need skilled workers? Sijangali yuki tu, but nda follow up. Pole pole, you do exactly how that works out. Like in Mr. Soki hint hint, you can come to the US could you could have a World Cup. Like in apply green card kwanza. This month you apply green card kwanza. This month you make a killer kitu. Do nothing. We apply for the green card. Perfection. Picture apply. Before the end of this month. November stone gets you and I'm gonna get your politics November. It's like elections. November that's town gets you green card. So do you know we can get it in life gap to be backy? Could I live in gap before twenty kwa nini kwa Leo ni 20th, sir. Hey, you only have one weekend. Next week itakuwa second. So itakuwa on Tuesday. So you only have like maybe 10 days to go to apply. Less than 10 days, 20th. 11 days, 31st. 11 days to go to apply. Apply walk away with your story. Apply to. Next week is the last week now get your green card. After that, sahau. Kama kuwa na application, araba, ni ataku run out of time, sahi. Ni 3.44. I'm supposed to leave by 4. It gets dark in two hours. So I need to fix that thing before it gets dark. Lafu mali mupa track kuna kuna lake sasa kuna mosquitoes so sasa kuna huko kama kuna mosquitoes so live itaisha soon video ya ku apply nilipost last week hata sijafikia maswali zimekuwa mingi maybe they do they do tongi story by day not track keep up to date so dennis outlet asamaja albo how much income a month do you think can set one up in minnesota to save me for someone starting life in america it depends on life study yako by the way sijui Musa manga minimum kwangu kwangu ile tu okay na basi kwangu ni kwa department of labor walisema if you make 35 dollars an hour alafu fanye maybe 40 hours a week angalia hesabu utakuwa poor 35 dollars an hour ama 40 dollars an hour tamele ile 22 5 dollars more if you making 40 dollars an hour alafu nafanya 40 hours a week hiyo ni how much 40 by 40 so 40 dollars an hour 40 hours a week itakuwa 004 by 4 1600 a week utakuwa sawa na, na factor taxes by the way alafu lipe taxes alafu whatever you have left over utakuwa sawa 40 dollars a week i mean 40 dollars an hour yeye ndio utakuwa poor kabisa uki make 20 dollars an hour na make come stay in your beginning lakini mko wewe na wife yako mtakuwa sawa mtakuwa na make you 40 bado your 40 ni a family income by the way alafu kama Wuna make 30 na wife na make 30 mko 60 mko above ile mbona sasa inakuja hivyo as a couple mnakuwa team work single itabidi tafute roommate mshe ya cost in the beginning before mimi niko na ma roommate sana by the way before ni move kwa apartment yangu niko na ma roommate lakini mostly kwa ma relatives alafu one friend ni azana my cousin alafu nikaenda kwa friend alafu nikaenda kwa relative alafu nikaenda peke yangu alafu as soon as me get high yangu hivi tena nikaenda na ma roommate sana ma cousin pia ile saa mimi niko na host watu kwa sababu niko na hiyo ability mpaka waka move out roommate zangu mmoja friend akaoa kuzo pia ka move on hivyo hivyo ikaza kuwa na familia so ikaza kuwa smarter na mbuyu na bro na ile kwa tu hivyo sahi mu host watu nimezoea ku host watu by the way ni kama una, unazoea but uko na hiyo 40 dollars wepe single 40 dollars an hour will be okay alafu kwa couple maybe 30 each mtakuwa sawa mke make 40 kila mtu mshaongeza lifestyle The best thing must be advance na your lifestyle, keep your lifestyle the same, start saving that money ama investing that money na assets, income generating assets. Muona sasa. Kama uko tracking that's very easy. The track itself in the business. You make more than you need. Muona sasa. Track you lipo 120. Mu na sama 35 ama 40. So imagine how much money you gonna leverage. You gonna leverage almost double the income. So I make more than I need in a month. 
So that's one of the always I'm always growing the business. You're gonna ventures in Guinea. I can invest in other things. So I make more than I need. I manage saying that to me and say, What a Kenya on your bedo laugh not to me, Kenya. That's not what I mean. I mean I make more than I need, more than investments. Zango. Every dollar ko account yango zoom more than a budget it accounted for. Kuna vitu nalipia behind the scenes za investments that I'm gonna help badai. Shares, insurance, nini vitu kwa hizo. Mwana sasa. So that's what that's almost a maile pasa YouTube, the mupatiana in a YouTube. So depending on my views, if I was making more videos, or if I was making more viral viral, viral video, I'm gonna patiana more money. Like excuse me, number two, I'm focused on educating people. I'm sharing information. Or either one of the two. Time in Anishia, and I'm alive in 12 minutes. Tell you, Angalia. I tell you, I'm going to fix your mirror and your antenna before Kesho. So, we may say my watu was the Jazzy DV lottery on or either 4th or 5th of November because elections. Why did the state include those two days for the DV lottery application? Ama, the the what did, do you mean by those days? Dante Prince. I mean, I can be a reality. America, but they don't have a conversation more than America. Elections is not a holiday. What one of the job was we come kawaida. It's not a holiday, by the way. Up in the States, we don't sleep. A kudanga holiday. The holiday in the 4th of July, there's a holiday. Kuna Valentine's Day holiday. Kuna official holiday. Kuna ile suggested holiday. Iyo dini November 5th is a time kasu buya in the job as we zioni. I find a vote zioni, by the way. Uzuri ya Minnesota so gana early voting. So me, I'm planning to vote next weekend in Manzana Nile. I'm out of this week sometime in Manzana Nile. I know who I'm voting for. Nishangalia kila mtu ni mwana kila mtu. Kwanzia school district, kwanzia superintendent, kwanzia governor, kwanzia mayor. Nishangalia kila mtu that I need to vote for. So then I vote in Manzana Nile story mara moja. Before after the 4th of November. Ni hile, some states, our langa early voting, I want to vote the same day on the same day. So, na bado watu wenda job. So, la ini ni mrefu. Last minute. But Minnesota was very civil, kuna early voting. But they were around for since last month, early voting. Ala pi kuna ile by mail, kitaka by mail, request by mail. But kuna aja, ini downtown city kutua pa headquarters. Ata neza walk in, say ini vote on ni endele, ni bilina shubuli zingine. Wana fungwa leo mpaka, nda vote next week definitely, next week nda vote ni mbaza nana. Ivo, ivo. Si holiday, si eti eti kuna, ati kuna, ona angali eti, oh, they don't really, divini, ah, eh, as insignificant kwa America ni kama it's a program run by the US Department of State you ni a small sub branch ya budget ata si ata si very small budget ata ni insignificant they don't really care ni department ya immigration una we need to bring people to America that's why ni minority it's not even part of the US government ata juka president na don't exist need to for the sake of racism out of the time by immigrants do racism now I'm about to talk about discussion in racism about that. So, ume soma ile book ya Dan Martel ya Buy Back Your Time. Ni kona yu books diya soma bado, but ni order ni kona ya. Excuse me, I'm going to publish and advertise. Ni share by book mom sana this year. Mom sana. Ni kwa laini tuna. Ni ile tu muskiza naskiza nga audio kwanza. Alafu I plan to read them. Sabu, ni kisoma mu pata more new ones. Ni kwa more new ones when I read the book. Kuskiza, you'll miss something. Sabu liku wana drive, nikiskiza, maybe nikapigiwa simu, nikamisi yo part, stack or rewind. Anyway, but nikona yu book already. I have it. I wish nikona nikulitari kwenyeshe. Laba nikona picha nikwenyeshe badai next time. Nikona yu, buy back your time. Nata kuisoma. But I know the summary already. Nishai soma summary ile already. Sikona ile apu mtumie, ile apu yangu. Mesa ile apu yangu ni wambia mu. Ito wanga headway. Headway. In a load. Ah, see as headway. In a load, say. Your app ni konai already. So, it's already there. In your camera, we did it, man. What just happened? It's just in me. Nearly funny. The camera, in me. It's just something weird. Anyway. Iko poa. Ah. It's on your camera. So, book ni konai already. You konai your book. So how many minutes? You got nine minutes. You can let tongue your application. It to me email. Alafu do nini? Swali yamisho ni gani? Kuna swali yote kwa diapa. Mandi yoi. Alafu dilikuwa naomba ufanya review ya ile kamera yako ya DJI Osmo Pocket Three. Dafanya review. I don't know exactly what to do na review. Mui to me already. Ah man. Of course, if you're doing review, if you're doing unboxings, you're doing review. 
but nafanya review it's a really good camera by the way hata nani alipenda sana nani uh, Kenyan American home Owen alipenda sana niko na muonyesha akujua kama niko na <laughs> si tumia kwa track mtu mia kama nikiona mali ile na feel niko if i'm self conscious mtu mia sababu ni very small ina ina the hand ni handheld ile Osmo pocket you know pocket camera very tiny ni small sana by the way na, nafanya review basi na jaribu kuja review taka kama kuna mtu mwingine na kufilm mimi sinanga ni mtu wa kunisaidia vitu kama vitu kama hizo anyway tuendelee nafikiri sorry kweli leo siwezi fikia nice time bro oh it's a time in Asia sanga tu Kenya sahi three watu wakalale bana sana mwanza live sahi nazana tiktok basi mtu anakama ni need anything hapa hivi Sachi kasema I need a wife yawa. Can you apply green card ukiwa ume file asylum? Unaweza apply lakini asylum kuna ile story ya change of status. Asylum au status. So apply to one but asylum au una status hiyo ndio shida yake. Sio sema mara moja asylum ni kujichoma. Asylum au una status hiyo ndio baya hiyo. But we file to No, no. I, I don't know what to tell you but asylum una status status ni F1 uh, B1 ile ulikuwa una visa you are legally allowed to be here uko na visa already ulipoa visa kuja states legally through the government consulate American embassy kapoa visa alafu kwa hapa hivi kama today you apply green card win you will change your status you are allowed you have to be on status to change status kama kwa asylum is like you're not even on status uko asylum so you could change it a story more sana but we apply to when we could end no there can be a true trial with about the term una win or the change rules it depends who's president president lakini kuna mtu mitonga headway yoga na ina summarize my books una kama saidi kitukua hii sahi kuna book kadha angalia kama naweza kabla za kwa video kuna how to make ish happen ndio app yangu kuna any personal information on make a video hapo niko na monitor video nataka kujua hapa hivi camera iko wapi tend defeat kama itaona ndio hiyo unaona hiyo sema how alafu kuna 13 mental strong 13 mentally strong people kuna the power of your mind of your subconscious mind john murphy unaona hiyo ndio hiyo tena tofesi yangu hapo alafu nitaka ku click ndio hizo book hizo book hapa hivi nazisikiza tu unaweza zote hizo summary tu ile summary kuna the power of now the miracle of morning the subtle art of not giving uh, f u c k no no Uh, not nice how to stop worrying and to start living mona sasa no excuses uh, love yourself love your life depend on it mona sasa kama hiyo the power of your subconscious mind you can tell most is my summary every day kama sahi kuna hii the uh, an f u c k yourself nilikuwa the last one four minutes ago nilikuwa nasikiza hiki kitu an f yourself no no ili kwa sasa muso yani nika mu repeat tu kila saa nimelipa hii app by the way annually so you know how much the whole year subscription so when i'm driving nasikiza tu ile nisaidia kwa ile ku kwa na hiyo mental exercise ku think the direction that i want to think about to carry so i've told guest the application mob leo time imeenda kwa i have to go ni kama 5 minutes to go application do you kama kawaida after you apply kama na go through la garaka la oh my goodness nimefungua nini hiyo mambo ya photo pia kwa hapa hivi application do you unaenda kwa begin entry nafungua authentication alafu na make video moja short about it bado video kwa available by the way kuna video moja ni make but ni ya mtu si yangu so inakam kwele authentication alafu nafungua hiyo form yenyewe if you need to see the application before apply andika comment and to me a message i'll send you ni kama kwa word document alafu anzi hapo hata sasa kuangalia kitu i'm running out of time nafaka kufanya ma repair haraka haraka before jioni umeona sasa So I say tazana TikTok kama kuna swali yote hapa hivi. Hakuna tamaza TikTok sasa hii. Nilimazi hapa ama, ama ni hivi phone nyingine. Sawa so, TikTok ndapatia treat leo. TikTok kwa app. Kuna watu wangapi TikTok sasa hii? Nimetoa phone hapa. TikTok na wase 8. Even the mood recorder record hivi. Ara karibu zimiki na kata kuaka. <laughs> Ta kujitoa. Even the mood do computer yangu ndio hii hapa TikTok na computer ndio hiyo live TikTok unaona watu wangapi TikTok 8 people computer ndio hii kwa live hapa alafu ile ni ya camera alafu camera ziko pale mwezi ziona kuna speaker kuna TV ndio hii audio source yangu hapa audio source ndio hii hapa hivi ni overkill by the way ni overkill msijali 
Overkill. Hii ni Rode microphone Overkill. Uh, computer pia ni MacBook Pro. No, no, MacBook Pro. Ndio hapo. Alafu hiyo ni monitor camera ile recording na post next week on Friday. Kamera nyingine ile pale alafu na kamera moja iko juu FX3. Kuna kamera mbili hapo mnaona hizo mbili. Hii ni speaker studio si tumi, hii nyingine na shoko room. Shati ya Kenya pale kuna ile studio nyingine iko dark pale. Kuna light hapa, kuna light hapa. Watu wa studio hapa hivi microphone ndio hapa hivi stand. Sasa shona simu tu ile just in case TikTok. Kama mimi live. <laughs> so even mean, whatever I'm saying right now na jiona hapa na pale ile ndio recording hii ndio live stream. Sawa. So, so tuna namba dai basi. Hii ndio tu TikTok. Tumaanze hivyo. YouTube mna bahati next time labda ndio kamera moja extra hapa ni issue ile studio na ka. Live imeisha. Swali nyingine ya mwisho hakuna nyingine. Apply, apply between this week. Next week in labda itakuwa the last video ya DV. Na try to make mapema mwaka nimechoka. Ooh, sijui. Atrai, lakini ita, ita kwa cold next week it's really cold next week so labda ndako kwa hao after do job 8 to 8 hours taona tu letafanyika alafu for the time alafu after this labda tutaanza kudu zile maforms zile watu maswali zile kama una apply for visa which which documents do you fill up na do research alafu na fill na nyinyi ni make video alafu iko hapa hivi ile tu resources za kuja hapa states alafu next year tutafunga channel to watch history of Malaysia states mta watching hizi ma video za kitambo labda tutakuwa tuna update sasa juu I think they make cover everything. Sije kama kuna anything new. Labda elections, labda nani Trump a winner tufukuze hapa hivi. Labda tutakuwa nyinyi Kenya tunafa ma lives zingine. Hata itakuwa irrelevant kudunga sana za CS duta kashafu kuzo sisi wote. Alisema hivyo natoa kila mtu. But these stories za Republican ni ni subtle racism. That's what it is. Mzungu anasema ngati I'm voting for the economy. Hapana. Ni ile tu anakula ngumu anashindwa how come I'm having a hard time and I'm supposed to be white. Hii ndio shida yake. Alafu anaona ah hata ni blame my immigrants. Na my immigrants black people ni 6 12% of the population. Latino ni 23% of the population. So itakuwa aje watu 12 na 23 ni ngapi? Hiyo ni 34. 34%. 75% ni watu waupe. Itakuwa aje mna complain shida zenu za kupata kazi na ku nini ku advance in life are being caused by a minority ya watu. Doesn't make any sense. It's the, it's the, ile ile That's the easiest thing to blame to out for your problems. Mwana sasa. I make any sense kabisa. It doesn't make any sense. Sasa mzee, nashukuru sana. Thank you for watching. Kama unataka hiyo file ya DV niko naye kwa niko na Word documents. Ila bana make code PDF. Ile tu ma ni kama instructions but iko 5 pages. It may reduce 5 pages. Iko rahisi. If you need it, nitumie email na kutumia kwa na ku forwardia wende uangalie ya kwa ile uangalie everything before to me kama nime simplify hizo si zangu pe mimi nitoa nini nimezi combine kwa everything any short form kama 5 pages do instructions za dv ziko 35 pages so ini 5 pages ile quick 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 to the point si swali mingi if you need it they share ama nime kisiki kwa za make video si juu ya tutaona tu kama nina time tuna baadaye basi tiktok ishaisha like share subscribe kama uja live already kama una swali kama kawaida comment down below kama uko na any information ya resources kama vile vinyer sema kupiga picha ya hivi 300 Kenya shillings uh, comment down below alafu kumbuka msi apply november apply before november msikie watu wa last minute man hii kitu important see you next time peace about tomorrow the live sasa <laughs>